Good evening, Internet, and welcome back to the ARAM Apocalypse. It is I, 8-Bit Ponies. It is Monday, the 29th of January, and we're back. I have with me uh, both uh, Olives and Bennett, and we're going to try this uh, Starfleet Battles thing again. Um, we're going to do a repeat of last week's battle. Uh, Coalition Forces versus Alliance Forces, Kazini and Hydran. Uh, played by <clears throat> Olives and Bennett, respectively, versus a Liren, going to be played by yours truly. Um, we are just wrapping up energy allocation now, try to get everything ready for the first turn of the game. <clears throat> so just bear with us as we get everything ready. Gentlemen, if you need... Uh, <clears throat> apologies, I'm, uh, I'm struggling a little bit. Something in the back of my throat. I'm going to mute myself for just a minute and see if I can hack it up <laughs> before we get going. I'm ready as well. If we're all good, then let's go ahead and uh, commit our starting locations. I'm going to zoom in on my side and figure out the location that I want to go, go on. Oh. Keep breaking things somehow, and I, I don't intend to. Um, see can I no I can't when I zoom in on a, a spot I lose the uh, there we go that's what I needed you guys are you guys have your locations starting locations figured out okay so let me know when we're all ready and then we'll uh, commit same time. <laughs> All right. Three, two, one, commit. Oh, you guys committed in. Yeah, it's, it's all. All good. Either way. Uh, a A29 for Olives and A13 for Bennett. Double uh, X22 for Ponies. So we'll uh, make that a reality. There we go. <clears throat> So it looks like I'm staring down the barrel of both of you, a little closer to Olives than Bennett. That's okay. That is okay. All right, are we ready to announce speeds? No worries, Luis. Thanks for joining. Happy to have you. Um, watch out for those gruesome horrors. I don't know what it is that you're playing, but uh, that sounds awesome. Um, are you guys hearing the music tonight? Ah, I just realized that... Are you guys hearing yourselves on the stream? <laughs> yes, I don't think... Oh, no, you're not, because I don't have it. I didn't set it up right. That's, that's on me. So, um, yeah, Lu Louise can't hear you either, so I'm getting that fixed. Saved by the snack. Now I can see the squeedlies and meadlies going in the right directions. There you go. And still good? Yep. Yeah, all right, awesome. 
cool. So we've got all the audio issues worked out. Hopefully the we don't have any other problems. <laughs> Snickers gives his seal of approval and we're ready to roll. So, um, turn order. Do, do we have names for this evening's sh ships? I'm... I never remember to do that part of it. Yes, let me let me change my. Can I'm just run keeping Inigo Montoya. You can. You could. Inigo Montoya survived last time, so he did. That's true. I've been we can... recovered, and yeah, we can. We'll stick with that. I like that actually. Um, and Conan the Barbarian. And mm -hmm. Conan the Barbarian versus the Far Me Stars too. Redemption. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Snack, if you want to name one of my PFs, you are welcome to do so. Um, I, I, had, I had the Fey Fang and the Doom Claw last time, but um, the purple, I caught them. The uh, those guys. Um, you can rename one of them if you like. Go for it. Um, in the meantime, let's go ahead and announce speeds. You want to start, Bennett? I am at speed. Uh, uh, math, math. Uh, 21. 21. Ooh, coming in fast. What about the Inigo Montoya? 21. 21. Okay. Uh, the Far Stars Redemption is coming in at 28. Oh, boy. Damn. <laughs> yeah, 21 is pretty fast, though. <laughs> okay. So that's, uh, that's a lot of energy there. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Um, do we, did Luis ever come up with a name for the, um, the other P, we'll, we'll check back with Luis once the PFs get launched. Currently have not launched any PFs. Uh, he's trying, he's trying to come up with a name. Working on it. Cool. Uh, we'll say, I'll shoot them all down for you. <laughs> all right. So we start this evening's, uh, with this evening's battle with 21s and 28s. We'll have 30s on the board, or 32s rather, um, due to the drones, which I imagine will be coming quite soon. What? No way. And shuttles um, are eight, right? Yes. Yeah. Six, six. 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 Okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, I'll go ahead and put 15s and 30s on the board, just in case, um, as we'll have fighters and and those types of things eventually and without having to ask Bennett whether he's using packs at this point in time I'll just go ahead and put them up uh, hide hide I just won't call the 15s and 30s yet because they're not on the board go ahead and keep so technically it is also possible, so in case you guys didn't know this already, technically it is also possible to put warp booster packs on normal shuttles and allow okay. for them to move double speed. So um, if if at some point in time you decide to do something like that, just <laughs> make sure you let us know whenever they get launched that they're wearing warp, warp booster packs because right. it is possible... Um, to do that just remember get double speed but you also take double damage that's a great name louise i love it the 8-bit fusillade i love it i love it we're <laughs> taking it that's gonna be the purple guy from this point forward 8-bit fusillade great all right we are we're locked in purple pf is 8-bit fusillade going forward um, what you doing there, Bennett? I'm just thinking. <laughs> <laughs> I, I turned my measure. I don't think you guys can see my measure, can you? Uh, no, I can't. Oh, no, I can't. Okay, now you can't, right? Uh, no, but ponies yeah. might be able to because he's running. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I can. So I can, you can still always see it. it. I can. Oh, always, well, then oh. I'll just I'll leave it on then, so Bennett can see when I'm doing stuff. I can turn it off. I can. No, absolutely not. No. <laughs> <laughs> Either way. This is still basically a learning situation, so. Well. I'm going right. right down to this far corner, Pony, so if you want to stay away. You got <laughs> it. 
I will. I'm not even involved in this. I'm just in the area path. I'm just commuting. <laughs> this is my trajectory. <laughs> yeah, not this really. Is area. All right. All right. Uh, so Luis, to answer your question, I I am working on coding a a version of this game. Bennett is going to actually start helping me code a version of this game to where we don't have to continue to use Roll Twenty. Um, everything that you see, um, well, everything that you see in uh, for all of our visuals are official Starfleet battles, like SSD ships and uh, utilities that I have just adapted for the, the purposes of using the game or, to, or of play in the game. Uh, By all the way, the... Olives. Go Sorry, ahead. I was just to say, Olives. If you need any SSDs, I have them all on hand for you. And for me, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so I'll go ahead and drop... I'm going to leave the uh, SSDs up. I'll drop the DAC. We don't need that for the time being. If we get to the point where the uh, SSDs are in the way for any reason, I'll, I'll remove them. But just, uh, just a reminder... Um, I'm playing the Lyran Battlecruiser. Um, Bennett is playing the Hydran Warrior Destroyer Leader. And Olives is playing the Kazenti um, Medium Command Cruiser. Um, um, from a point value, for, for purposes of balance, we are perfectly balanced down to the very last point, which is not all that easy to do. Um, so if the Great job for you guys picking out stuff that I was e easily able to match. Um, last yeah, time, yeah, was hundred percent intentional. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> well, uh, last time it didn't go so well for the alliance. Uh, we we will see if this time will be any better. Um. So I guess uh, without any further ado, do we have any electronic warfare on the board currently? Um, I think so. Yes. I have three ECCM. Okay. I have five e ECM. Five ECM and three ECCM. Okay. Yes, I have sir. um one ECCM currently on the Dang. Far Stars Redemption. But you still have a decent shift there, Olives. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah, you do. yeah, I got gotcha. you. You're, you yeah, you're five to one. Yeah, five to one, which means you've got a, a, a shift of two currently. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, absolutely. That's absolutely correct, Luis. Uh, all of these ships are are good for different roles, uh, and you, as you will see, um, each of them, by virtue of being uh, different from different empires and having different weapon systems, uh, are are good in different segments of the battle um hydrons generally speaking are a very much a melee race in that they get in really really close and try to do damage and try to take uh or absorb damage uh well um the kazini are more of a kind of a fringe uh okay. s stay out of the fight stay out of the the melee sort of uh race um they they fight more with their seeking weapons, and the Lyran is a little bit of both. Honestly, they're they're capable up close, but they're also capable of playing the running game. We shall see how it goes. Um, so now, without any further ado, any more gilding of the lily, we shall begin. Uh, first impulse, first turn, impulse one. Nobody moves exciting impulse two <laughs> wow 21 and up um slipping I'm already slip. i'm gonna move forward i'm going to release a shuttle fantastic <laughs> good start An another weather shuttle just to make sure <laughs> yeah, just, just weather shuttle. Out. You, that's right research research only yeah got it <laughs> Uh, <laughs> make sure the wind's not blowing too hard for your drones. Right. Since you're you're just commuting to work, this is this is what um, 
a an Uber for That's some right. of your crew. <laughs> That's all right. Space Uber for some of the Kazeni crew. Got it. Impulse number three. I got to move this thing around a little bit. There we go. Impulse number three. Um, 28s and up, which is just me. Impulse number four, 21s and up. Shuttles. Um, there you go. Okay, sorry. Or word. There you go. I'll make that a little easier on you. I was digging up my notepad, hiding beneath all my school books. Let's, let's not let's move that out of the way. I don't need that. Impulse five. Um still twenty one and up. Oh I didn't move uh did I have you I, did. I, I I did move? No, I've only moved yeah. oh, twice. twice. I should have moved three yeah. times by now. Yeah. Okay. This is yeah. this will be my fourth move. All right. Hey Stick so asked a question if you wanna Oh yeah. Yeah, so, I, was, I was just gonna respond oh, okay. to that. If ponies wants to take it, that's fine. Um so Scout has a specific connotation in this game. Scouts are generally ships who are uh, more protective in that they allow for things, additional things like electronic warfare or uh, tactical intelligence. Uh, they have specific uh, weapon systems, not specifically a weapon system, but ship systems called sensor channels, which allow for like deep scanning for attempting to um, protect their um, their uh, allies from um, both direct fire and seeking weapon attacks, um, and things like that. They're more information gathering and uh, protection type ships, not specifically healers, because that doesn't that doesn't even happen in this game. But um, what you're referring to though is more of a like a fast in, fast out, gathering information. And no, the battle cruiser that I'm flying is very much a, a uh, a, a combat ship, a an up close and personal type ship. Yeah, pony ship <clears throat> is the biggest on the field right now. Yeah, since I'm playing one ship versus two ships, I have my ship is basically double the size of theirs, the individually. Mm -hmm. I would say that me and all of his ships are two specialists, and ponies is kind of a mix. Yeah, the two. Yeah. So right. impulse impulse five was. Um, your third move, gentlemen, and my fourth move. I've already completed my fourth Two, move. Sorry. Yep. Oop. Oh, okay. I didn't move on five, so I need to move. Yes, yes. you do need to move on five. It wasn't everybody, though, right? Just 30, uh, 21 and up. 21 and up, yeah. Six has yet to move. All right. Impulse six is sixes and 28s. Yeah. <laughs> Here he comes. Impulse seven is um, twenty one and up. Impulse eight, we are at one quarter turn, twenty one and up. Actually, I'm going to slip. Hmm. I'm going to release a uh, a Type-C RSC drone. Okay. Open fire. Oh, okay. Now, uh, refresh me again on the, 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 the forward arc situation. Forward arc is... Um, I'll, I'll draw it for you with the... The, I can the, target the your ship from here, right? Absolutely. It's anywhere okay, between good. these two right. lines. Yeah. Good. Good, good. Okay. If, if you weren't in this arc, though, I couldn't have targeted your ship with it. That is correct. Okay. Yes. All right. You got all your paperwork done for your drone launch on Impulse 8? Uh, yeah, target, and <clears throat> uh, that's it, right? That's it. That's all you need to do. So now we got 32s on the board. 
target and what type of weather you're recording. You know? and oh, the, yeah, 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 gotcha. Impulse. Right. It, this, it's actually going at the border. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Impulse 9. Wait, Olives, you're, the, the target of your drone there is not in your forward arc. Uh, what's that now? The target of your drone is not in your forward arc. See, Bennett is oh, well yeah, outside. Oh, yeah, Bennett's not in my forward arc. Yeah, no, well you're right. Outside. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. My bad. Sorry, I'll, I'll move <laughs> next time. If you consult page 1706 of the book, I found an obscure rule. That... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's on your team, it's you actually called a, don't need a to boomerang be. drone. Got it. <laughs> Seven, page 1706. Uh, got it. Yeah. I'll look that up after. <laughs> you got it. All right. Uh, impulse 9. 32s only. So I- anywhere, really, right? As long as it's moving I towards mean, me, yep. That's probably better there then, right? Um, either way. Yeah, either way. That's fine. 17. Yeah. 17, yeah, whatever. Yeah, okay, good. Um, impulse 13. Whoo cracking impulse 13 uh wait, thir- wait, wait 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 what happened there on 12 i thought on 8 i released drone c didn't i you yeah you, you oh you did my mistake that so that was i'm looking at the the row number not the impulse that was number. nine right there that right? was that was nine that the drone move you're correct so impulse 10 is the impulse we're going to and it is 21 and up the answer is 10 bennett so what do i do now uh, you say it opened. <laughs> okay, good deal. Uh, the my 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 scatter pack just opened up. Fantastic. But it's it hasn't moved. It's just sitting there. Right. That's so fine. You, you wanna put yeah. drones you wanna put drones on yeah, the map yeah, yeah. on that, so the scatter um, packs are more of a, a fast two, drone deployment system than a get close. Three. Yeah. Four. Five. Okay, now the well, that's gonna be a nightmare when I have to. I'm gonna put no, behind... you can... I'm gonna put them behind it. I know where the... I know where they are for this first move, though. Yeah, you can yeah. you can do like uh, drag select to select everything in the stack. Well, oh shit, this is a disaster. My shuttle, <laughs> <somewhere>. <laughs> shuttle is missing. Uh, I don't know where the shuttle is. Hang on, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna help you out here because I saw okay. I saw you move it over. So bear with okay. me in just a second. We'll get it all together, and then there we go. Yeah, we'll send now, that all the way to the back, and then yeah. drag select your drones and. All right. All right. So there you go. So this... now my, the bad news is if I want to. <laughs> We can't really pick this shuttle up though right now because it's it never moved anywhere. Well, you can at some point in the future you could turn I can around turn and, and go get pick it. it it's, up. The good yeah. news is it's probably safe from ponies. Well, if he's <laughs> shooting the shuttle that has yeah. nothing in it, we're happy with that. <laughs> <laughs> we're we're, we're good with way. it. Yeah. And All right. If, if okay, this thing gets like, uh, I don't know. Everyone, twenty-one and up, no sixes. Okay. okay. But the and sixes... if this game gets extremely scrappy, Olives, I can always like send some of my shuttles over to you. Yeah, but that's a real, real <laughs> hypothetical situation there. <laughs> I think you run out of drones before you run out of. Yes, of that's probably true. Well, he only shuttles. has two shuttles. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Does Good his point. drones move the turn they open? They do not move on the turn okay. that they open because they only open after the move. Yeah. Um, I am looking at Master Weapons Charts. There we go. Just make sure that I have all of the things that I need there. And now I do. All right. Um, so on that turn, see, I've moved one, two, three, four, five, six, seven times. This will be my eighth movement. So mm-hmm. have, have you guys all moved on that turn? Yep. Or yes, for that yes. turn? Okay, cool. But my, my, my scatters don't move in because they, they release on that turn, right? Correct. That is correct. Make yes. sure. All right. Then um, we are going to move on to Impulse 11, which is um, now your, your shuttle, having pr- fulfilled its purpose, is no longer moving. Yeah. But everybody moves except the shuttle. Yeah. How do I select all? You just, just kind of click and drag, drag select. Yeah, click yeah. and drag over. We'll select everything in that stack. 
Oh, I see. Um, okay. Cool. Well, actually... Everybody moves. Let me get out of here. Thank you. <sighs> Whatever. We'll do it. Okay, it's so in there... fame or die in flame. The Air Force says. It, 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 is, it is likely that both will happen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's probably <laughs> true. All right. Impulse 12. 28s and 32s. Hmm. I'll do that. 28s and 32s. It's all the drones. Yep. And I am going to, uh, on impulse 12, I'm going to flip on two of my ESGs. Out of how many do you have again? Four. Great. Okay. And remind me on the rules on that. If you have two active, can you activate another two? Yes, oh, they okay. th they all activate and um, and operate entirely separately. They're so independent, yeah. The only the only rule that that matters really there is um, where they don't actually release until four impulses after. So I've activated on twelve. 12 to 13, 13, 14, 14 to 15, 15 to 16. On 16, they'll turn on. See, Louise, this is this is the real annoying part about ponies, guys, here. These big shields that kill me. Yeah. Okay, so we're on, moving on to 13. You which have not it, deployed your little guys, right? My, my yeah. PFs are, are yeah. still locked in. Correct. They're still locked on. And if you deployed them while your things are up, would they take damage? As long as they stay, as long as they don't pass through the the I ESG see. sphere, then they're okay. Oh. Um, moving to impulse thirteen, we have twenty ones and up. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. It begins. See, the, I did not. Okay. I'm going to turn. Yes! Okay. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Just. Yes! <laughs> I like it, I like it, I like it. Uh, yeah. Hey, uh... Mm -hmm. Releasing another shuttle. I can do that anytime I want to at this point, right? Mm -hmm. I okay, think gotcha. so. Just, just, just recall that you can I only have... control 12 at once. So 12 at once, that's correct. Whatever's over 12, they just drop into the, drop into the universe. Correct. Yep. Sounds good. All right, okay. moving moving to impulse fourteen. Um, twenty ones and up. Um, I have a really bad idea here, Olives. I'm gonna release a. Um. I have a really, really, really bad idea. Yeah. <laughs> what if I turn into him here? Well, I'm just going <laughs> uh, It sounds like a fun turn one, if you're asking me. Yeah. Well, it I also just... sounds like a certain doom. Well, it was last time. <laughs> All right. Let me let me look at my turn speed. I'm just gonna release. I think I'm gonna release. I'm trying to just get my head around these. Uh. No, I'm. I'm not. I'm not. We're not that crazy. Um, because you're big. Oh yeah, the PF. Oh, that's your turn. Okay, yeah, your big ship just turned completely. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, 
I'm gonna go ahead and throw the other. This is this is this is thirteen. This mm -hmm. is impulse thirteen. Uh, fourteen. 14. We just finished fourteen. I'm gonna, go, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and throw the other shuttle out. All right. Uh, thirteen or fourteen impulse. Sorry. Four, fourteen. Great. Yeah, don't don't forget about that thing, olives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Um, I am looking at. Well, hold on. We should probably talk about it. If well, are you gonna are you gonna uh, do it? Well, I've already released the shuttle. I've already released the shuttle. Yeah, we should talk about it. Okay. Yeah. So, we well, found think... a rule. <laughs> okay. Well, I found a rule. F three dot five transfer of control. Yes. He can transfer control of his drones over to me in theory, right? Assuming that no, I I want to look at that one because I have thought about yeah. that one as well. Um, F assuming that you have the ability to control seeking weapons, and you mm -hmm. do. Because okay. even though you don't have drones, you do have the ability to control seeking weapons. So I would say, I would rule in this case, that yes, you he could transfer control of drones over to you. Okay. okay. Um, it doesn't affect who I target, right? Correct. That That's still... Correct. I don't have to target Bennett's ship for that, right? I don't have to send him his way. No, no, no. Weapon. No. Correct. It just means that instead of your ship steering them in, it just means that now my ship's steering them into the same place. Yep, 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 yep. yep. You, you still sensor? six, six, yeah. Yeah. perfect. It's a weather, it's a weather shuttle, but I guess you'll have fun with that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I paint the target instead of you. So, I would say the turn before that weather shuttle um, finds out what the weather is. Uh, <laughs> you give me control of of. Six so I have, to I have to declare that, right? Yeah. It doesn't cost any energy to do that. It's just, it is what Correct. it is. It just is what it is. It is. Did, you, did you already dump your second shuttle? He did. Um, do you have a second shuttle to, to do that with? Did I, oh, no. Can you, can you, uh, can you yeah. do that? I'm working for on it. me. Yeah. You are. Just a moment. Um, can we not just select the whole screen, please, Mouse? Thank you. Yep, I'm taking the uh, extra. And I think you're still in my forward arc, so. Correct. Mm -hmm. And you're, I can't not target your PFs because they're not even on the board, right? Yes. Correct. Okay. Sadly. I, I, yeah. <laughs> I figured that was the case. Yes. All right. Um, just taking one more. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's the that's the trade off. Twelve. Oh, I should check actually. Watch. Okay. Are we ready to move on to impulse fifteen? Yes, sir. I, th I think so. Impulse fifteen is twenty eights and up. It's not me. Oh, cool. Very cool, Louise. I like that. Yeah, just, just me and uh, and all my new friends. All what? your all your new friends. My weather oh, friends. Mm -hmm. There you go. Um, um. All right. Um. Uh. Anything additional going on, there, fellas? Um, I don't know. I don't think so. Not from me. Okay, I actually have um a decision to make here. Mm. Oh, actually, uh... and I think I am going to hold. Does anybody remember when I turned? I'm sorry. I don't let on twelve. Um, you've moved or twice. 11. You've moved twice since you turned. So. Well, is it impulses or movement? It's movements. Yeah. So. so oh, movement. Move okay, even better. Gotcha. Yeah. Yep. Um. What impulse are we on? This was that 15. was fifteen. Yep. Oh God in heaven. 
16 is mid-turn. 21 and up. God almighty save me. <laughs> and our ranged target is 10. Um, okay. I feel like you got some drones coming my way, Olives. <laughs> what? <laughs> Count for, the other shuttles? You mean in general? For for six for turn, Im, impulse sixteen. Have you moved those drones? Uh, oh, we're we doing it right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Gotcha. And your your ship moves as well. Yeah, but not my shuttle. Hmm. Uh, I'm going to release a B. Okay. How many out do you have right now? Uh, well, I only have this will be my eighth out right now. Okay. <clears throat> I got one scatter out plus a C plus a B. Yeah, technically, yep. technically the scatter pack, the the second weather shuttle, is also a seeking weapon until the moment that it opens. Yep. But so, so you've um, got eight out right now. Nine is nine is okay. Oh, so I see. So now I have nine. Yeah, turn, I, could, I, could do, so I could do twelve seeking weapons at once. Correct. Yeah. I the got turn you. before that that second weather shuttle does its thing. I get. I understand. Yeah. Announce I that you're transferring. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I got it. All right. I'm trying to count all the things that I got to worry about here. <laughs> yeah, I think you're okay considering. I don't know what the hell I'm. I mean. This board is getting massive for me in terms of. Luckily, they all move together, so I don't have to like. Yeah. And they're all going one place. Oh so. god. <laughs> um. <clears throat> Anything additional, fellas, for sixteen? Or are we moving on to seventeen. Um. So I'm done with bees for this turn. I think I have a sound <laughs> alert I'd like to play, but other than that, <laughs> oh, I'm in danger. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> Very near <laughs> and apparent danger. Yeah. Impulse Nothing 17. 21s and 32s only. By the way, um, at Impulse 16, because I forgot, mm -hmm. um, two, my two ESGs came on at range 0. So they are mm -hmm. in my hex. They are strength 5. You said, what did you say? 32s and what? 32s and 21s. So, not me. And not your shuttle. Um, oh shoot, that's my other. What, is it? what was that? Oh, that was my other. That was my. Other. That was my B drone. Oh, my B drone does move. Yeah, it stays with you. Yeah. Forgot I had that guy there. <laughs> <laughs> God. Uh, gosh, I have a decision to make. Hmm. This is a little close for comfort. <laughs> okay. Have you moved or are you still waiting? I'm for trying to decide if I shoot off my fighters now. Ah, I see. Because I don't want to get blasted with them still in hangar. Sounds like a really bad idea. What are the chances that you're going to take three shuttle hits, though? Um... I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm kind of scared. <laughs> uh, well, we'll keep him in. We'll keep him in. Okay. Uh, impulse 18. Um, 28s and up. Does your circle open up yet? The... My ESG? Yeah. Yeah, it, it it came on at impulse sixteen. So okay. we're, we're I don't I don't see the the circle indicator you had last time. Oh, uh, you're you're right. I didn't turn it on because it was range zero, but I'll go ahead and turn it on. Oh, it's range zero. Okay. Yeah. Can you see it? No, you can't see it because it's because of the radius. It's just range zero. But it it is uh, that's on. That's fine. That's fine. I didn't realize it was range zero. Yeah. Just my hex. Yep. That. Did I do that right? Yeah, I did. It just doesn't it doesn't show because of the 
radius. All right. Um, impulse 19, 21s and up. I like how, well. <laughs> Im impulse um. 20. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh, no, no. <laughs> uh, impulse 20 is 21s and up. So what what determination are we making if I hit the edge here? Um, I can't. Yeah, don't. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> um, we'll we'll just say that you leave combat. That's effectively. Fine. Um, yeah. I think I can do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is this is getting real. Impulse twenty one. Uh twenty eight and up. Oh, talk, 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 talk. Um You have disruptors on board, huh? I do. That was impulse twenty? Yep. Twenty one. That was impulse 21. Correct. Olives, do you think his disruptors are overloaded? Well, he's flying at 28 speed, but he doesn't have any ECM. I got one ECCM. He has one ECCM. Yeah, so the, he might have just dumped those. Well, did he, he overloaded him last time. Not on turn one. Okay. That's correct. Well, if all else is being equal, then what? I think he just sacked the ECCM for... For this All game. right, <clears throat> I am. Oh, I'm gonna lose him again, aren't I? <laughs> All right, I'm I'm deploying the airplanes. Whatever. Cool. The hell. This is the virus. Your stingers are. Milo oh. and Otis. <laughs> Or the right. Red Sonya and Wilt Chamberlain. Whatever his name was. <laughs> Wilt Chamberlain. Shaq and Kobe. Shaq and Kobe. There you go. <laughs> you got to go with other Arnold characters, so it's got to be <laughs> uh, the Terminator uh, and Mr. Right. Freeze. And the guy from Kindergarten. <laughs> and Mr. Freeze. <laughs> Jack Quaid. Mr. Jack Quaid. Oh, God. Jack Quaid. <laughs> That's his best one. Give this people air! <laughs> <laughs> no. They're they're going speed fifteen. Okay, fifteens are already on the board, so we'll uh... <laughs> fantastic. Impulse twenty two. Um, everybody moves. That includes your sixes back there. Or your, yeah, I'm your... giving Bennett control of. Uh... Of these of these drones right here. Which ones? The these? six. Well which ones are the six? These oh I'm sorry, yeah, yeah, those. I have these here. here. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. It's fine. It's it's uh click and hold, Alice. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, those. Those are yours now. Great. Oh, that was not good. Okay. Was, Every... Okay, this is everybody moves? Everybody moves on 26. Or on, I'm sorry, on 22. That's yeah. correct. Clean my little shuttle guy here. Mm -hmm. um, did you turn? I, wanted... I did. Fabulous. I can't remember if I moved this one here or not. 
don't know if I moved that guy or not, but I don't think I think I did. Okay. Uh, I didn't even move my ship still, I think. Are there the same uh, pickup requirements for uh, fighters as there are for shuttles? You cannot be moving more than twice their speed. That's correct. Okay, but I'm not, so we're good. Are you going to make it all the way up to the top again? No, no, like for my oh, fighters. Okay. I can bring my fighters. Oh, I see. I thought you were going. had like a long play where like on turn five you were going to pick that shell up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I played to be here till three in the morning. Uh, so we can pick up that shuttle. Just to pick up a shuttle because it's in the mm -hmm. rulebook that we can do it. So. Yep. All right. So, uh, he ordered Uber Eats for me, so I have to give him his food, you know? <laughs> <laughs> or I guess I'm picking up my food from him. Either way, whatever. All right. Impulse 23. 21s and up. Okay, my scatter pack explodes. Scatter 2, as it's called. Scatter 2. Mm, do I want to do that? Do I want to slip? Or do I want to slip? I'm going to leave him right here for now. Are you in my four? Oh, yeah, it's definitely my forward arc. Yeah. yeah. Like right in front of me. You slipping into me? I'm. Uh... Oh, we'll go straight ahead. Uh... Uh... I'm sorry. I was getting my speed. Did you say that speed again? Say the speeds. Are it was the, uh... 21's enough. 21's. Okay, so everybody. That's, yeah. Not my fighters, but everyone else. Everybody Did except you move for your, your drones or. No, you, you're still oh, I still have to do them. Oh, give me the break. <laughs> <laughs> and I still have to move my ship. Give me control if he wants. But I could make it easier. They're um, going the same place anyways. It doesn't yeah, really matter. Yeah, they're, they're, they're coming in on me. I get it. I'm going to go ahead and slip as well. Mm -hmm. And you are currently at range what? Uh, 200. Eight. Okay. Um, impulse. Hmm. Let's see. I'm looking at a thing. Yeah. Okay. I, I'm not. I'm not. The copium's coming out again. <laughs> I'm not in a horrendous situation yet. Impulse twenty four. Um, 15s, 28s, and 32s. Okay. Are my fighters considered nimble? They are. Okay. They, which means they move after me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... What a disaster. Oh my god, I, I accidentally clicked on the... There we go. Okay. Alright. Let's see here. Uh, on Impulse 24, I am opening fire. Yeah. Um, I am going to fire... Four disruptors. Okay. Three of them are overloaded. I'm dropping okay. batteries to overload. Okay. Um, but all four of them are going to be fired at your fighters. So two overloads at one fighter. Actually, yes, two overloads at one fighter and one overload and a standard at the other fighter. So um, the stand or the overloads are one to five. So I'm gonna roll okay. those first. That's all three. Um, let's see. So, so sorry, I keep clicking the wrong pl places. All right. So disruptor number one is a hit. So disruptor number two, which is at the same target, is a hit. So that that are fighter is destroyed. Overloads? Those are both overloads. Correct. Right. Okay. So red is destroyed. Uh, red is dead. Oh damn! 
Then um, overload number three at blue hits. And then standard. Come on, come on. Is a one to four. So that is also a hit. So that's nine points of damage on him. He is now considered crippled. Yeah. What? He's got one hit point remaining, correct? Yes, sir. All right. So I will mark those guys as. Does it have weapons still? Deaded. I. It has weapons, but it can't fire those weapons. I oh, think that okay. it can still fire the phaser, maybe. But yeah. I will, I'll have to confirm on that. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just realized that I'm on grayscale on all of my SSDs. Yeah, I, I had that too. Yeah, just I'm looking for There we go. Um, yeah, this guy has... All right, well... <laughs> One of these weeks, those fighters are going to actually do some stuff. <laughs> mm, they did some stuff, actually, there. Yep, yeah, they, they soaked oh, I guess up. they got rid of the disruptors. Yeah. They soaked yeah, up disruptors. Well, do, you know, do you know what that means, Olives? It means Hell Wars are locked and ready. Oh, I see. The disruptors <laughs> were all, uh, they're all gone now? All four of my disruptors uh, have fired. All four of his disruptors yeah. are gone. Yep. Yeah. All right. Um, impulse... Five. Impulse two five. Let me, let me mark because I fired on on twenty four. All right. Impulse twenty five is thirty twos and twenty ones only. Do I? I don't want to do that. That's bad. Oh well, it's not a turn. It's just a slip. Slip out of here so I can get this thing pulled. Here they come. We don't think I moved this guy here. Sorry, what, what speed? 21s, that was you said? 21s and 32s, correct. Right. So like I've been, uh, let's see here. What's my. Man, the drones, the, the drones only just run into you, right? They don't do anything else. Correct. They just, they just. Like I, I don't have to. I don't, I don't fire. Administratives can fire phasers, <clears> but, <throat> thing, but scatter yeah. packs just. Yep. Yeah. Uh, uh, range still isn't very good. Yeah. You doing anything else, Alice? Uh, I think I'm gonna let, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna do my my last C, of okay. um of this turn. Cool. This is twenty six or twenty five. Twenty five. Okay. Oh, There's a lot of drones. Is he under? He is under. Yes, it is. Mm. A lot of drones. Right. I'm gonna go ahead. Yeah, why not? Why not just fire drones, right? On twenty five, I'm gonna go ahead and. Well, I'll have to wait until 26 to do it, so never mind. Because I've, I'm already past that point on on 25 with him firing drones. That is not... The, that's not the measurement. <laughs> <laughs> that is the... Okay. Right. Impulse 26... Um, is um, 15s and up. I should have moved this guy first, but whatever. Mm, actually, um. this guy's going to move down instead of slipping. Oh nope, never mind. I'm uh, I'm making bad, I'm considering making bad decisions. I am um, activating two additional ESGs. Okay, what radius? You don't know until they come on. Oh right. Yeah, four impulses. Wait, what? Um. Oh. 
And you activated what? other ESGs. What, what, what impulse did you activate your other ESG? What, what should I know about that in terms of the rulebook? Uh, impulse, impulse 12 was when I activated the first ones. They released yeah. on Impulse 16, which means that they will stay active until Impulse 16 of ne the next turn. Unless I run into something. Okay, I just don't... But, but I, I shouldn't see a shield yet. You still... You see them. Oh, I just don't see them on the map, I guess. That's what was confusing me. Yeah, yeah because the radius they're, zero. Yeah, the radius oh, zero. Oh, I see. <clears throat> they're just in my hex. Oh, I see. Uh, I gotcha. <laughs> okay, well... In the last game, you had uh, you had a radius two. Correct. That's which, which okay. is why they showed on the map. I gotcha. And that costs you extra energy to choose the radius, or what's? The, give me the rundown of that real quick. I I have as many as five points of power in the in each of my ESGs. Okay. Um, I can choose strength and radius, and the the wider the radius, the less damage they do. Okay. The tighter the radius, the more damage they do. The more gotcha. efficient they are. Um. Okay. That's four impulses. Four impulses till they come on. They they will yeah. activate on impulse thirty. Okay, so imagine for a second it was rate you had your things here at radius one. Uh huh. So that means it would be like this, 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 this. Correct. If I'm in this tile here, or this hex here, and then they turn on, do I take damage, or do I take damage once I leave? Um, or you take I damage leave? by passing through them, but okay. they, they reach out to fill that hex, so if they come on while you're at range one, you would take that damage. Hmm. Okay, but if I'm at range one and then they activate to range two, would it hit me? No, not until you pass through them on the way out. Okay. <laughs> I have a. Well, we'll see. We'll see what the rage is. We'll see what the rage is. You have a terrible plan. <laughs> yes, <laughs> but you know, I, I've gone too far to to give it up now. <coughs> Impulse right. twenty-seven. Uh, twenty-eight's and up. Oh, twenty-eight's and up. Yes. Okay. Lots of drones coming. Lots and lots of drones coming. Um, let's see here. What are my arcs? Uh, yeah, not happening. Do I have a turn yet? It's one, two, three. No. Olives, this is a scatter pack, right? Uh, I was trying to name them. You can't see the name though, can you? I can't. Yeah, that's a that's a scatter, and that's a scatter. Got it. Okay. That's a C. Uh, that's a B, and that's a C. I'm naming them personally, so when they hit yeah. your shit, that matters, right? Yeah. Warhead wise. No, they're all the no. same drones. It just depends on where the C and B differentiation is just how much you can shoot. Oh, okay. That's good. Well, that doesn't matter if I name them or not. The scatters matter, but... Uh, the scatters, yeah. But... but they all do the same damage warhead-wise. Mm -hmm. Correct. Okay. Alright. Um, impulse... Impulse 28. Uh, 15's and up. Um... And when did you activate the circle? 26. Okay. Fantastic. All right. <sighs> Terrible idea. Engage. Oh, now you're in my forward arc. What yes. do I have now? Um. Hmm. Okay. Nothing. I hold. I'm opening fire. Yeah. On my shield two. Yep. So I've got you center lined, which means I have eight phaser ones and four phaser threes that currently bear. Yeah. I'm firing them all. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. It's gonna hurt. Yeah. It's gonna hurt. So you had ECCM powered, correct? 
Uh huh. Okay. Uh, uh, yes, ECCM. Yes. Correct. Okay. So then there's no shift because I also had ECCM, but it doesn't matter because there wouldn't have been a shift to begin with. Um, yeah, so I am going to um, absolutely light your ass up. <laughs> um, let's see. But in addition to that, let's see, I am going to, I'm going to lower, making sure, yeah, I'm going to lower my rear shield. I'm going to activate a transporter. Okay. And I am going to place a transporter bomb. I'm looking at the arcs real quick just to make sure that I get this right. Uh, pull up the, pull open the, the tome here so I don't have to lose my page on the other one. So bear with me just a second while I go and find this. Uh, transporters are uh, G8. Hmm. G6, G7. G8. I'll try to get lucky and not uh, is uh, not know where it is. Oh, I'll see the transporter bomb. Though. Yeah, he's going to see the transporter bomb line, like here. I think yeah. is what he's thinking. Um, yes, uh, actually, that's exactly the place that I want to put it. Um, because that's that's inside that arc, the mm -hmm. the rear shield arc. Oh, hang on, um, one two. So it would go like this. Um. Bennett, you've got, um, you're building your line by, how are you putting waypoints down? Oh, uh, shift. Oh, uh, no, so, not shift. Click, then right click, then right click, then right click to put a new point. Got it. Oh, shit. That's not, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> Back door. Not, you don't have to shift at all. Just right click. I don't know why I thought shift. Make sure. Um, yeah. So one out of out. I think that's the that's the way that, that goes. I'm just looking at the diagram. Um, up. Over, up, over, up. So, up, over, up, over, up. That's the that's the range. So I will have to place Damn. one right here. Where did you get the energy to charge your transporters to? One point of power charges five transporters. But you're going speed 28. <laughs> that is correct. I'm going speed 28. <laughs> so... Yeah, so that's that's where that will be. Four, so I'm lowering. This is impulse twenty eight. My uh -huh. number four shield is down. Okay, so that's the trade off. You don't have a back shield. Correct. For now. Okay. For now. And then, so question: When this moves in, that gets hit, and then when this moves out, it doesn't. Correct. Great. You'll get some internal with I this guy. I got you. So you shoot it out the back a certain amount of hexes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, olives. Where's your ship? Oh, back here. Yeah, he's on the other side of the now, of the line. Yeah, and I ha my only rule with the drones is I have to move towards you, right? Mm -hmm. Correct. So I'm so gonna move towards you. You're gonna yeah. This scatter pack, technically my scatter pack, yep. is gonna die. Yeah, but you still have a lot more coming. I gotcha. All right. So now eight phaser ones, four phaser threes into Bennett's mm -hmm. face. Mm -hmm. Let's do that. So actually into my side. But, well, you know. but into the side of your face. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we'll roll these and we'll count them because I've I've been terrible at counting them in in uh, after rolling them all. So we're range two. Yeah. So that is a four. It's four points of damage. That is twelve total points of damage. That is sixteen total points of damage. Twenty total points of damage. Twenty. Yeah. 20, uh, actually, 
27, it's, it's 26, because I counted the first one as an 8. The 26 okay. total points 26. of damage. Ooh, 33 total points of damage. Mm -hmm. That is 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 shots. So 33 total points of damage so far. Two fire, two phasers left to fire. Ooh, 40 points of damage total. 44 points of damage from phaser ones. Four phaser threes still to fire. So one, two, three, four. Not ideal, but that is another uh, four and six, another 10. So that's 54 okay. points total. Yeah, well, uh, 24, 20 on my shield and four batteries. Okay. So. So 30 go in. Yeah. Okay. Let's hope it's worth it. Okay, what are my shields? Center hole? <laughs> In, uh, center warp. I'm not going to be needing that after this one. <laughs> assuming, my pl assuming my plan goes, goes through. All right, so uh, uh, okay. Bennett, you roll the DAC. Um, Olives, right. you keep. I was just seeing my but I was seeing my button still work to this. Oh, well, cool. you can roll if you, you roll. Started. Okay, yeah, you roll them then. The so first one's a four. Four. That's a we phaser. Have, we have thirty going in. Thirty total going in. That's correct. Uh, so four is a phaser. It's got to be one that bears, but anything to your forward arc or your left side. Yeah, that's perfect. really not kind. Um, kill, uh, kill number one. Number one? You got it. Okay. And we'll mark the that phaser off. There you go. Mm -hmm. Okay. First shot. Five. Five is a right warp engine, which you do not have. So we will go into hull. Which you've got nice. plenty of. Oh, oh God. All of us. Better rolls. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta call him for me because I can't see him. Okay, there 12, you go. 12. Yeah. 12 is auxiliary control. Oh, one, never mind. I one time those. only. That was your shield number six, right? Shield number two. Oh, I'm no. Seeing. Um, flipped over. Yeah, you're you're correct. I'm gonna, I gotta mark that off. Shield number two is down. No, you're, you're right. It is six. I'm, I'm dumb. It is six. All right, let me figure out how to... There we go. Control, control Z, Control Z, yeah. Oh, that's not what I want to do. Okay, what was the... Oh, it's an 11. It's a torpedo, so that's yeah. one of your fusions. Um, C or D? Um, they're both forward arc. Just choose one. Let's just take the, the one on that side, then. For okay. aesthetic purposes. All sure. right. So that's the 12 and the 11. Five. Okay. Five. Five is another hull. Okay. Nine. Nine, it would be left warp, but we skip it, so it's another hull. Nine. Another hull. Eleven. Eleven's another phaser. Uh, two. You got it. Five, Five is another hull. Seven. Seven is cargo forward hull. Okay. Three. Three is a drone. That's a hell bore. Uh, do you have a, you have a preference? I don't care. No. Okay, so I'll take a forward arc. I didn't Seven. know if you had different different powering or different charging for you. Oh. Do Does I? Does that matter? Does that matter? No, we chose the right one. Okay. Then seven is another hull. Six. Six is um, another hull. Six. Another hull. Six. That's another hull. Mark of the Beast. Yeah. Three. There's another phaser. Oh, damn it. Um. I get four on my, my Gatlings. <clears throat> four charges. Yeah, four phaser three charges, correct. Let me do some quick math. Twelve. Four. Where's my phaser once? 
Oh, nine. Uh, give me the 360, or kill the 360. You got it. Um, I don't care. Next up, olives. Oh, yep, sorry. Was... Nine. It's a hull. Nine. It's another hull. Four. Is a transporter. Uh, uh, which is your one and only. One and only. Oh, so I've got two transporters. Ha, funny. You you act like I still have mines left in the ship. <laughs> <laughs> Four. Is um a impulse. Okay, when you, you said that, Bennett, does that mean you secretly drop mines, you don't tell anybody? Uh if you roll them out the back, that is correct. Yes. Okay. But you don't you roll can... out the back through what? How do you roll out the back again? You use, you uh, use your shuttle bay. Mark it. Yeah, you use yeah. your shuttle bay. And then you, you mark, write it down where they are. Mark oh, okay. the impulse, so, mark the hex, and you just keep yep. track of where that is. I yeah. gotcha. I gotcha. Yeah, it happened about six weeks ago where I didn't understand when all of a sudden Pony said, yeah, I had a mine right there. And I was like, what? Yeah. Uh, I didn't remember that part being announced. Okay. Roll me a 10. No, that's How a five. five. Five is the last of the hull. Now things start getting more interesting. Is it 10? Haha, <laughs> thank you. That's a, that's your other phaser one? It's fine. Alright. 5, 10, 15, 20. 10 to go? I think so. Damn. Right, I see 15. 12. Oh god. I see, I see, uh, sorry. It's bridge. Oh, let's hold on. Yeah, it's an emergency bridge. Oh. I'll go ahead and mark that. Um, you there, there it is. So I'm counting 16 in the back. Uh, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. So seven to go. Um, okay, we'll take it. Okay, here we go. Ten <laughs> is a tractor. One and only. Oh, oh, oh the, lives. The, <laughs> the hyd no no hydrant anchor for you. <laughs> Impulse eleven. Eleven Damn. is another impulse hit. That's really bad. Nine. Oh, I know hulls left. Uh, yeah, no more hull. So cargo battery. They're empty anyway. Yeah. Can't get through those. Oh. Another twelve. Oh, no. As a that's scanner. Gonna, that's gonna kill some drones. Oh no, scanner, not sensor. Okay. Scanner. Yeah, scanner. We're good on. Yeah. Well, now I'm to a one though. Yeah, well, we so have you, three. Um, so I'll count them again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, twenty-six, twenty-seven. Three to go. Okay, three to go. Okay, give me a quick ten seconds on uh, when your scanner power is only at one. What that affects? So the scanner to to um, to to make it simple. The top number on your scanner is what you add any time you roll the dice to fire. So oh, I see. if it's zero, oh. you add zero. If it's one, yeah, you yeah. add one. Yeah. Okay, so it makes it tougher to hit. Yeah, because you have no, you have no. It's like Top Gun, the Nintendo game, when you had no freaking right. You, auto, you have auto no... focus or whatever. Right. <laughs> yeah. So nine. What? What's the point of that? Oh, because some of these rolls are higher than. Yeah. Okay. So right, three to go. Right. Ten oh, is lives. another impulse. <laughs> Killing me, literally. <laughs> Two to go. Eight. Eight is a APR. Uh, is that one, one to more? go? Yeah. Last one. What do you not want here? Uh, hit another APR. Oh. A nine. Yeah, that is battery um, another battery. Yep, we'll take it. I have just been... I just realized... All of us, we've been playing at a major handicap. What happened? I did not realize I have 8 APR on that ship. Wait, what? Those? Oh my god, you you do. You've got 8 APR, not 4. You've been playing with oh, 4 fewer... Energy. Energy. Because I have... A APR. I, I I have eight APR squares on my ship. Yes, you yeah. you have four more, points of, four. So four more points of power. That points of power. That 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 hurts. Okay. Is that is that reactor or what is that? Yeah. Yes, yeah, your reactor. 
So you lost four points of power with your four, your three impulse and one APR. So yeah, you that's, that's what happened. You didn't actually that's lose anything. Touched. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> feels, oh. feels great, man. So what could that? Uh, <laughs> could that it have helped I you at any point? No, uh, yeah, I could have re. Well, the chances I reinforced the correct shield is yeah. zero. I could have gone faster. Probably wouldn't have. Probably yeah, would have yeah, yeah. more ECCM. Uh -huh. So in reality, it didn't change much. But yeah, yeah, you you probably would have been more ECCM. That's probably good true. to know. So okay, one more point, one more piece of information for you, Bennett, because of what mm -hmm. is about to happen to you. Mm -hmm. Um, so movement or damage incurred due to movement happens before damage or before um the the remainder of the turn so if i slam into you with my four esgs running mm -hmm. and you take the 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 full brunt of that you won't get to fire after uh, until after we resolve that damage okay so just I just want you to know I don't want, I don't I want you to go into it with your eyes open, and understand. How many see you away from those opening? Well, two of them are already on, mm -hmm. and have been for almost half the turn. Yeah. The other two activate in two impulses time. Okay, that's what I thought. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. On the last impulse of the turn. Uh, on on when impulse thirty. Uh, well, we'll oh, get are we, thirty oh, out of thirty-two? I thought we we're on thirty now. We're oh, on okay. twenty-eight now. We're on twenty-eight. Great. Okay. All right. So that that is that. Hey, real quick. Uh, two questions. My shift. What should I think about that? If I know I have a shift against you, what should I think about that in terms of range? Does it affect my range table for phasers? It doesn't. It doesn't affect you at all, or your firing at all, because that's what you've got is defensive. ECM is yeah, defensive. E ECCM. Is, so when you fire at me, I have an advantage. Correct. I roll. Gotcha. I add two to my dice rolls on you. Yeah. Which and is real quick. Uh, oh, sorry. Yeah. Which is the reason that I went after Bennett because I, I didn't have that. And you run away from drones makes sense too. You knew I was going to have a lot going. <laughs> and you run away from drones. Yeah. Just go try to kill him before all that shit gets there. Um, right. And then also the um, disruptors are uh, use them or lose them. But what's the impulse uh, into the next turn if I fire them? Is the eight, eight, what's, what's the cooldown? Eight? Eight impulses cooldown, correct. Okay, great. Okay. Uh, just well, just str strategy mind, that's why I fired my disruptors at impulse 24. Because at eight impulses later... ready right away. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Well, you know, and in my case, I'm just not close enough. Yeah. Uh, um, I am. I'm, I'm semi-close I'm semi enough, but I'd like to be... Uh, well, I'm not going to get to the main thing. So I guess actually at this point, I'm as close as I'm going to get for for what it's worth. And his back shield's open, so. Um, yeah, yeah, but you're not hitting his back shield. I'm not? You're, you're no, on the... you're hitting his shield three, looks like. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, the, the line for my back shield is right here. Uh, I see, I see, I see. Yep. Or maybe even down more, even. Maybe even down even more. Oh, I see, I see how it's open there. Yeah. Yep. Okay. All right. Um, moving on to impulse 29. Um, is 21s and up. Okay. Okay. Okay, now, uh, let me move all these other ones before we do get these other ones. How much damage there. do your big shields do again? I don't remember. Like, where do so I figure that out? It's, uh, it's on, on the combined, um, manual. It is page, uh -huh. um page one or sorry 1282 so based on the uh, okay. based on the um the strength factor you mm -hmm. do your 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 power times the number of energy points that i put into it and so yeah. the strength factor at radius zero is four so it's 20 points of damage per at this point and you have two i have two right on. now Correct. I guess I should have let you move for me my drones, theoretically. Um, oh, these guys, these drones move. That's that's true. Sorry. Well, these I'm waiting for you. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm thinking. Yeah, so I guess, but just so I make sure I don't miss anything. So after I don't do it, people say, hey, dumbass, you could have just not moved there. But mm 
As all, if all I have to do is get closer, is there a way to avoid these things as long as my hex distance closes? Or no, unfortunately, like I'm not I going to let that happen. Do it and... Yeah, I gotcha. Because I, I thought at first, I thought, well, this is that's four hexes and that's four hexes. But um, yeah, they can't move to intercept, five. right? So, so I was just thinking that if I was there, if I was here, oh, I'm still I see close. what you're saying. I yeah. see what you're saying. Yeah. I'm, I'm assuming if I get anywhere around the one hex there, I, I hit that, that bomb. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah. I just um, want to make sure that wasn't an option. So I'm like, it's like, hey, dumbass, you could have just moved. You could have just slipped those things up because you should have been closer. Yeah, I'm going to turn. Now, th this guy would not move here because that would be moving to cut me off. It would have to move here, and that's where... Okay, so the 4-hex thing doesn't matter as much as the the path. Yeah, correct. Yeah, so okay. if, if, you're, if you're drawing a line to my ship, it will move along the path. You got that yeah, correct. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. So then all these so guys just die? All six of those yeah, will go off with the mine, and okay. so we can remove those six. Um, I'll remove the... the so then I should have waited. Mine. Like this guy here probably should have went here. No, he's still fine. Yeah, they're all fine. This all guy, fine. this guy right here, was here. He could move here. That it was actually where. That's where he would be better. So yeah. So I think mm. all these guys probably. I. This one's fine. I think the rest of them are fine. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, and remind me the one that's that's facing backwards. That's the scatter pack. The rest uh, of these correct. are, are yeah, singles. Yeah. Okay, the rest of course, singles. the international signal scatter packs, the backwards flying drones. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. Um, okay, so I mean, it says it says disruptor range is one through four, right? I mean, I mean, not, I'm I'm at fifteen. And, but damage is one through four, which is the same damage as the next two ranges. Uh, Correct. Um, yeah. Like I'd have to get to range two before it got any better. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I, so I think I think I just unload them then. Do it. There's no What's reason not to. Yeah, yeah. 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 So I'll just fire all four of them. Uh. Okay. So now I roll. Uh. That's going to be on shield. He's two. on, yeah, it would be number two. That's correct. Okay. I was trying to get behind his ship um, the whole time, but I just couldn't quite get it done. Uh, D, that's a D, uh, D4. No, no. <laughs> D, can I do a D4? <laughs> D6. Uh, <yeah. laughs> D4. Oh, no. So that's one, one miss. Hit. That's a hit. Oh no! That's a miss. Okay, That's a hit. Miss. So two hits, and at that range, you're sitting at three points of damage per. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Cool. That's something. Yep. And I get him back sooner. So. All right. Let me change the the uh, image style or image type, image mode, so where I can actually mark those. Yeah. There we go. So on the eighth impulse, or eight impulses have to pass. On, eight impulses have to yeah, pass. Eight full impulses have to pass. So on after fire, firing. So. Correct. So firing for me on twenty four, soonest I'd be able to fire is impulse one. Okay, and I can go impulse seven. Um, if you're you fired thirty now. You're you're you fired on twenty nine. Oh, oh, on twenty nine. I'm, I'm yeah, we're on, we're currently on twenty nine. Okay, yeah. So I'm impulse six. Yeah, correct. All right. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, I'm going to. Let's see. Well, no, he I'm already good. fired. Did he not? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. I was just thinking of other things that I have available, but I don't. I'm about out of tricks for. This, this what's that mean turn. Bennett when you say that what does that mean well once you fire <clears throat> you can't like after you like after you say I'm firing and you like deal the damage you can't say, oh, oh I'm actually firing too 
Yeah, that's true. No, I, I don't have any weapons to fire. I was thinking of other things, but so but everybody has correct. to declare firing all at once before. We yeah, do it. so okay. you can't like react to. Oh, I didn't take as much damage. I'm gonna. Fire oh, I see. Me. Yeah. If I could, I would have fired after I took the damage there, but <laughs> I, I got gotcha. And when you say, f- f- what's the phaser cooldown? Same. S- same. Any weapon okay, is okay, so everything. Every weapon. Okay. Yeah. 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 Well, they're and... still. That's almost worthless there, though. Yeah, it's just a waste of power. Yeah, waste of uh, an impulse is really. That's um, yeah. Yeah. Um, next oh, impulse. They hold for the next one. Right, mm-hmm. right. You don't yeah. have to. Yeah. Next impulse is impulse 30, which is uh, 15s and 28s and up. 15s and 28s and up. Okay. 15s and 28s just and up. My, just so my five. All the drones plus. No, points. just my fighters. Your drones. Oh, yeah, and your drones. Right. Yeah. Um, okay. How many points was I supposed to put into charge phaser? None. None. Okay, good. I was going to say. Yeah. Because I, I definitely didn't. Uh, does your shield pop up now? Uh, it does. They're all at range zero. Right. All right. Yeah, that's uh, not where I wanted to be, but we're okay. Um, huh? Are you good, Alice? Do you move every, everybody? Yep. Okay. I am doing some bookkeeping. Okay, we're good. All right, impulse thirty-one. <clears throat> Um, is 21s and up. Twenty ones and up. Who boy. Um, so I think this guy and here that... would, would just go... Sorry, how long do you have to keep or how long do you get to keep your your circles up until your spheres up until you have to recharge them? Thirty two full impulses uh, that they'll stay okay. up from from time of release. So so you so if you don't pay for them this energy allocation, they'll drop at halfway through or whatever. Yeah, uh, uh, two of them they'll, will. They'll drop. Yeah, two will drop at at sixteen. Yeah. Well, they're going to drop regardless, but two two will drop at sixteen, and two will drop at thirty. Oh, so even if you pay for them, they don't stay up? I can't keep them up for more than 32 impulses at a time. I can turn them right back on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you but still have I, to wait those four. Four impulses, correct. Okay. Okay. Where did my... Oh, my guy's in there. Thirty two. Um... Yeah, impulse thirty-two. Uh, everyone moves their last move for the turn, and I'm gonna slip. Cut. Damn, dude. Yeah. Only I my know. tractor was still up. Oh, you know. Hey, I didn't lose any energy. Look at this on the bright side. Um. <laughs> Technically, you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so actually, oh well, everyone moves, right? So my fighters move last because they're nimble. Correct. And does picking them up count as? Does that happen before or after movement? So, uh, I will go and look at that because I, I'm not entirely certain on that. Uh, okay. So, so I will go and take a quick look. The drone hits at zero, right? Not a one. Correct. Okay. All right. So shuttlecraft and fighters. So fighters. Or I could turn my fighters into dr- or my fighter into a drone. <laughs> Great. Strap. Strap a. Interestingly. Interestingly enough, you can make it into a uh, a suicide shuttle. Oh. 
<clears throat> and uh, there's I something. Yeah. Does it still something... move speed 15? Um, well, I don't think it does after it's been crippled, but um, oh. I, I haven't. But yes, otherwise it would. And I'll have to confirm that, actually, because I don't know that that's a possibility that you can actually do that. Uh, right. I assume that you can, because consider Shuttlecraft. And PFs can also be made into suicide versions, called Death Riders. Huh. I'll just I'll put that little piece of information out there. Um, his, his things are still up, though, so if he deploys those and yeah, yeah. they die. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, uh, you should do that. And let me Absolutely. get this straight. I've got, um, I can't, those shuttles just, I have no other, play, I can't reload scatter packs at this point because I have no shuttles. Correct. Yes. Good. Okay. Just, they're just floating in space. Um, my only drone options next round are just my B's and my C's. Yeah. Can I reload, uh, can I reload the B's and the C's? If you take them offline for a full turn, you can put okay, but two right spaces. Right now. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you don't yeah. want to do that now. You can, yes. Oh. All right, Ooh. so when a shuttle is crippled, its maximum speed is reduced to half of its rated maximum. So, okay. So you're, you'd be, and that is rounded up. So you'd be able to move your, your fighters speed eight going forward. Your fighter. Does that happen right when they become crippled or the next? Um, I, I think technically it would. Okay, well then. But I didn't, I, I didn't consider it. So, what what has gone before at this point in time doesn't matter. Okay. Do um, eight still move on this turn? Yeah, on this impulse they would. That's correct. Okay. And then can I pick them up after movement? That's what I'm looking into now. Yes. Right. Um. um, 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 um so, landing. Launching, launch, land sequence. Shuttle can launch once per turn, land one, once per turn. Can launch and land in the same turn, but not in the same... Let's see. Launch tubes. Launch tubes can be used to recover. Um, recovering shuttles. Landing aboard. Unassisted. Um, shuttle may only land. If both... A shuttle may land aboard a ship under its own power if both the ship and the shuttle are in the same hex and the ship is not moving faster than the shuttle. So, in faster order to... Faster than the shuttle or faster twice than. as fast? No. Oh. So, so there's there's um, unassisted landing, which you have to be moving the, the same speed as the shuttle. Or there's okay. assisted landing, which you use a tractor beam, which unfortunately ah. you don't have. Okay, um, well, and this guy's just going to do that. <clears throat> yeah. Right. Oh, other than the crash landing. So there is a possibility of crash landing. Um, let's see. Shows can land. Oh, that's... that's um, only if, you, if you're landing in a space that's already occupied, but that doesn't, that doesn't matter. So no, we, we've got that figured out. Yeah. Uh, Twelve eighty-two. Zero. Five. No. All right. So we're we're moving into turn two. In order to do that, we are going into energy allocation for turn two. So. We'll yeah. Um. Get that way, man. All right. Olives. Let's pop down. Let's do it. To wherever. All right, see you guys in just a little bit. Mm -hmm. All right, so all told, I'm pretty pretty happy with the way things have gone thus far. I've got damage, significant damage on the hydrant, and I haven't. I've taken six points of shield damage. I still have my my PS, though they are locked to my ship at the moment because I can't drop them. I would have liked to have been able to actually do something with my ESGs by this point, but limiting them to um, range zero has uh, effectively put that uh, so that I either had to ram Bennett, which I didn't want to do, uh, or wait for drones to hit me, and that has been a little bit more difficult than I 
honestly expected. Um, just because I've been moving so fast. I thought the drones would reach me faster than they did, and I, I think the activation was a panic activation. Um, I wasn't, I wasn't expecting to get away from the drones, honestly. So that's that's where we are on that. Now I have to decide what what do I want to do with turn two. I've got Bennett hurt. Um, and so, but I, I still have to face the command cruiser, and that's going to be the the difficult part. Is I've still got nine drones coming in. I've got probably six more coming this turn off of his rails, and then he's got a full set of weapons. He's got four phaser one, six phaser ones, four disruptors. Yeah, and so I'm going to get hurt this turn, but I think I'm going to make it so ridiculously costly for them that it, I think it will be worth it in the end. So let's go, let's go see what that happens. Um, that means energy allocation. It's going to be a very different turn as I will not be able to move nearly as fast. Um. I don't have the batteries available this turn. It's there. I go this route. Where is that going to leave me? Not with a lot, huh? Good news is that I don't really have to. I don't have a whole lot of um, I don't really have a whole lot of limitations on what I can do it's just what I have power to do and I'm very fortunate in that this ship has significant a significant power advantage over the the other two guys so I'm going to do this, and I'm going to do this, means I'm going to be at a bit of a dearth for a bit on one aspect. I don't want to speak too openly because this fellas might be listening, but, oh. gotta be careful no I'm gonna do okay so in in the uh, in this in the uh, pursuit of fairness I'm going to go ahead and roll my UIMs because I fired UIM um, disruptors this turn and that will inform whether or not I have disruptors this coming turn. So um, I will go ahead and roll that. I'm saying that out loud on stream so that there's a record of it. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and take care of that before the, the fellows get back so that I don't have to wait until they're done to, to finish my energy allocation. You have to figure out where where those rules get stuffed. Um, and I'm looking for that. Should be in uh, fire control systems, right? Or under disruptors, it'd probably be under disruptors. We'll have to go check there. D6.5 for complete instructions. Okay, so that is under fire control systems. Oh. 
Hey, would my ship be considered crippled for life support reasons? And not no, because you haven't lost enough power. Like so, crippled power. ships. Yeah. yeah, crippled ships are primarily those who have lost at least half their power. And when's your uh, rear shield coming back online? Impulse four. Okay. Okay. I'll be right back. Oh, just. Oh, I don't know if you'll come back. If you'll have heard me. Um, I do, I am going to go ahead and roll. Okay, so then I can continue as I had initially began. And Okay, so then I can... I think we are ready. It's going to be a big turn. see what crippled crippled uh, fighters can do for Bennett's benefit. Uh, our rules. A uh, heads up, um, so since I'm just burning time at the moment until the fellows get back, um, we'll, 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 never mind, there, there they are. <laughs> Welcome, gentlemen. Welcome back. Okay. 
Um, we'll see. All right. So, a uh, couple things. While you guys were away, I, I went ahead and put it in chat. I had forgotten that since I fired my overloads with my UIMs, I had to roll to see a roll for burnout. Okay. I rolled a four, which was um, sufficient to keep them from burning out. Great. So, um, I, I will potentially have disruptors this turn, or have the ability to fire my disruptors this turn. Whether or not that actually happens, or if I have the energy to do that, we shall see. But we shall see. Uh, okay. Well, are you guys are you guys good to go? Ready? Yep. I think so. Yeah. All right. Well, let's um, let's go ahead and go with speeds then, Bennett. Nineteen. And Olives? 24. <laughs> and my speed is 3. Oh. <sighs> Olives. <laughs> it might work after all. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> and, oh my god, he must have other stuff just out of, out of this world. Yeah, he's going slow as a snail, but that's okay. And defensive. I got a lot of things to charge. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. He does. Hmm. And Hellboards, like, prioritize your spheres, right? They do indeed. <clears throat> okay. Well, I made the right decision. Um. <laughs> oh, oh, Olives, we also have this drone here that's going in. Uh-huh. And that's no shield going in. All right, um... Sure. So... Yeah, that will get that will get inside there, but it's gonna the hex is gonna the, he's still got a zero hex ESG up, right? Correct. Mm -hmm. It will strike so the ESG you're... first. Yes. Yeah. So, yeah. so that yeah, then we get to actually see what happens when something strikes an ESG because we've never seen that before. Oh no 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 yeah we'll see that multiple times this turn. <laughs> is that right? <laughs> we have we have a few crude battering rams coming. Yeah. In, huh? Oh, I, I see. see. I would say speed three and thirty twos. We're gonna all these things are gonna come at you pretty hard here. Yes, I agree. Um, <laughs> I yeah, olives. I well, we're just gonna make this thing happen, Bennett. it? Make it happen. All right, just sorting my my uh, ships and the tor turn order so we can see that the Montoya is uh, is the fast one of the lot. All right, so we've got. Uh, we will not have 30s this turn, I, I imagine. 24s oh. will be our fastest guys, other than uh, the drones, obviously. Um, so let's see. Hide, yep. Then we have 19s on the board. Okay, and then we have potentially... Uh, your 15s are down to 8s, right? Um, yeah. Okay, so I'll keep those, and then I'm three. Well, I'll go ahead and add 16s as well, or sorry, sorry, sixes as well, in case somebody wants to get squirrely with shuttles. And yeah, okay, so we've got uh, threes, sixes, eights, 19s, 24s, and 32s are on our list, correct? Mm-hmm. Okay. Then Impulse Numero Uno. Uh, nobody moves. I am going to activate my transporter. Oh, wait. No, I can't. Never mind. I, so not, I, not even 32s move, huh? Oh, I'm sorry. 32s do, in fact, okay. move. Yep. So, my mistake. 32s we'll move. see. All right. So that drone strikes my ESG. The ESG does four points of damage to it to destroy it. Mm -hmm. And my one of my ESGs is reduced by four points. So the damage just reduced... Okay. It The warhead does not strike the ESG. It's the, the yeah, physical no, body funny. of the, the drone that does. Yeah. Now that is that is different from if a an ESG was struck by a mine. An ESG that strikes a mine takes the full damage of the mine's explosion mm -hmm. to the ESG. 
Okay, so these drones. Are I can. Not do can I roll out multiple mines in one? One per shuttle bay. Okay, but multiple in one turn. Per turn, yeah, one per okay. shuttle bay per turn. Uh, also, I can high energy turn right now, right? You cannot on impulse one. Fuck. Okay. Well, I'll wait for impulse two then. <laughs> All right. Then, um, did you move all the rest of your drones, Alice? I did. Yep. Awesome. Yep. Impulse two then is nineteens, twenty fours, and thirty twos. Okay. High energy turn. So you move first, and then oh, high did energy I turn. Slip? You slip. You got to slip directly next to you. So yes. Yeah. Whatever. There you go. I am also 19s. high energy turning. Okay. Nineteens. What did you say? Nineteens uh, and up. Okay. Uh, let's see here. I'm also performing my HET. And I'll do this. Hmm. Um, okay. Electronic warfare. I, we didn't call electronic warfare. Nothing for me. Okay. I've got one ECCM. One ECCM. I have four ECCM. I'm going to go ahead and remove my turn marker there because I am, I'm beyond it. I just want to see what I'm looking at here. Uh -huh. So Bennett... Um, you're on the line. Did you move ready to have move drones yet? Yeah, I, I don't move. I'm moving speed three. Oh, okay. I won't I won't move for a little while. And mm. I move forward. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Alright. Um let's see. I'm looking at. I am opening fire. Anybody else? Nope. Okay. No. So I'm firing four overloaded disruptors at Bennett. Yeah. So. <laughs> Um, that will be, we are on the line, as you can see on the shield line. Yeah. And you are the faster moving target. So yeah. that suggests that that is your number six shield that I'm firing into. Yeah. So four overloads, um, one to five as a hit. So hit. Miss, miss, hit. Okay, not as bad as I as it could have been for sure, but um, that is still going to be two overloads at range four. Four. Uh, that is um, sixteen points of damage. So that'll be sixteen internals. Okay. There you go. Go ahead and roll those up. All right, I'll roll them. Uh, give me a second to clear the damage chart because I haven't done that yet. Hope that I can still do that. Oh, yeah, there we go. 16 of them, I'll track this number. All right, okay. all right. Benny, you want to roll them then? Yep, give me a second. All right. Four. It's a phaser. Um. Gotta be the left side. Uh, yeah, whatever. Kill it. Alright. Ten. Ten is an I can't hit a phaser now because that's the was the last one that bared. So that'll be a tractor, which you also don't have. An impulse, which you don't have. Oh boy. Forward hull, aft hull, right warp, APR. APR is hit. Four. It is a transporter, which you don't have. Um right warp impulse. Forward, aft, left, warp, APR. Seven. Um, battery. Three. Drone, Hellbore. Okay. Ouch. I didn't charge it, so. Oh, <laughs> Eleven. That's the fusion. The, the, the okay. torpedo. 
That yeah. sucks. I did charge that. Oof. Four. Um, it would be uh, all the way out to APR again. Nine. Is uh, left warp cargo battery. Last battery. Uh, another nine. Um, lab. The eighth shield. Four. Right warp impulse, forward hull, aft hull, left warp APR. Okay. Eleven. Can't hit a phaser, so it's a tractor. You don't have tractors. So damage control. Five more. What the hell does it take to hit a center warp on this ship? <laughs> I've got to get through your batteries and hit a seven. Six. Um, sensor. No, lab. Sorry. Forward hull impulse lab. So you got labs left to hit. Eleven. Um, damage control's been hit. Center warp. Ask and you shall Six. receive. Um, lab. Two more. Six. Lab. One more. Ten. Ten. Um, APR. Okay. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> I think I know what's going to happen next. What? <laughs> Did you? you? I don't know. I don't know how these things work. Oh, that's me. Duh. Oh, I'll, oh, I see what you do. That, okay. You rode over your last turn's energy allocation. Oh, yeah, Olives, you could use... Yeah, uh, use... Subsequent columns. To the next, oh, I next see. Column. I gotcha. Yep. I'm like, wait, what, what <laughs> happened to your last energy allocation? Yeah. Okay. Anyways. All right. All right. Um, next impulse mm -hmm. is going to be uh, impulse number three. Mm -hmm. um, that is 24 and 32. That's all I just got one. So, no, that's a. Is that six of them? Uh, yeah, that's my other scatter pack. They got turned around somehow. <laughs> that's scary. I'm not sure what's going on there. Okay, so this one's going to hit here. Yeah, so that's another four off of my ESG strength. So, I've, I've taken eight total points of damage to my ESG strength. Okay. Thus far. And you are my forward arc. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to release a B drone. Okay. More coming Always, in. Don't kill him too much. I need to take enough damage so that I explode <laughs> on him. Um, I am going to release my PFs. Okay. So bear, bear with me a second as I uh, pull those onto the board. And if they move off the same hex yes. as you, if they hurt themselves. Correct. I don't know why that happened, but okay. All right, so the 8-bit Fusillade and the Doom Claw <laughs> are online. Um, actually, hang on just a second. I, I, I have... Uh... Man, I need to learn that not every race are the Gorn. You know, no, I can't. I actually cannot do that right now. That was that was a mistake. So I, I, I'm going to take that move back. I, I cannot actually drop them at the moment. So yeah. I'm taking that back. My apologies. I, yeah, that was a mistake. All right. Anyway, um, impulse three complete. Impulse four, nineteen and up. And eights. Perfect. The second battering ram. <laughs> um, I'm going to fire a phaser three. Okay. And um, at, range, at this range, I can do no less than one point of damage, so I will kill the final phaser. Or the final fighter. 
How much energy does it cost to overload a disruptor? Four. Hmm, okay. So, um, blue is dead, and I fired one phaser three. Wait! Oh, you shot at my, at my fighter. Yes, correct. Oh, okay. Oh, I can't turn yet. Wait, Fine one. with me. Two, three, four. This is impulse four. Um, that is correct, impulse four. That was the okay. earliest that I could have fired that. Um, and that was my... Oh, I slipped. Let me mark that. Sorry. Thanks. Yeah, that's fine. Mm, do I have... I do have this. Okay. Let me get that ready. Oh. Mm. Oh, just making four. Sure, before we do anything too crazy here. When, when we say... Uh, um, at uh i i can think <laughs> at uh, weapon status three we can have two drones prepared my fighters don't count as those right correct okay <laughs> two shuttles you mean yeah mm -hmm. yeah that's Did correct. i say drones you said drones okay my bad no worries okay uh let's... all right Impulse number five. Um, 32s only. It's my turn radius thing. I'm satisfied. Okay. Um, impulse eight, sorry, six, row eight, um, 19s and up. I hit then I guess. Yep, so that's another four off the issue. Which takes it down to twelve or takes it down by twelve. Um so I if I'm facing this way I turn this way, right? So I don't want to do that. That's a you can't see, but that's a turn, right? Correct. But you so would turn there. I would turn there and move into that, right? Correct. Yeah. You turn into the move. And that's still forward arc, so that's good. Yes. And then mark that on six or on uh Yeah. Mm, I'm in a bad spot here, Olives. Yeah. And I'm gonna release a this is impulse six, so I'm gonna release a C drone. Can I transfer over control of seeking weapons as soon as I release them? No, it has to be the the, the following impulse. <clears throat> okay. I'm deploying two. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Then I will... Um, Olives, where's your scatter pack now? Is it this one? No, it's the closest one. The closer one. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's that's, that's perfect. Olives, unfortunate. Um, okay. Let's see. Oh, you know what? Oh, never mind. Actually, all right. Um. Two weather shuttles for me. 
Right, weather shuttles. Mm -hmm. I am going to open fire. Again. Um, it is going to be eight phaser ones um, into you, Bennett. Yep. The ship's dead. Uh, I have to destroy it. I have to destroy it. Because if I let you get in close, close enough to do what you want to do, then Olive's going to eat my lunch. Um, still might, still might he, do something. Yeah. He he still might, yeah, a hundred percent. He's got a he's got a real good shot. Um, but I've got to destroy you. So, um, what's at range Dang. two? Minimum damage on eight phaser ones is going to be um twenty four points of damage. So you can you can survive that, but so I'm gonna have to roll them. Uh, um. <laughs> It, yeah, well, we, we could survive. You've got... Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Did I just lose... I just lost your ship. Oh, there it is. I'm going to bring it back. We're going to bring it back. There it is. Okay, so you've got 14 warp. Yeah. Four shuttle bay. Um, I can't hit that phaser. So that's 18, 19, 20, 21, 24... If I ever roll anything higher than a six, you're going to explode. Yeah. I, I, I need to, to guarantee that I kill you. I need to hit you five times after I hit all of the, the things that I can hit. That's one bridge, two APR, four shuttles. Um, we'll go ahead and throw the phaser in there and the probe. So that's one bridge... Two, uh, seven, eight, nine, and then fourteen. So that's twenty-three. I need twenty-eight points of damage on you. If I can get twenty-eight points of damage on four phaser or on eight phaser ones, you explode. So we need eight sixes in a row. I need for eight a six. maybe survive. <laughs> for a maybe survive. So let's see where we end up here. So I'm number no statistician, but that's a sh that's a six. That's a six. <laughs> Okay, there's a two. Yeah, okay. Okay. So Bennett explodes. Uh fortunately taking with him his two shuttles. Mm. Uh, um yeah, and so I fired at eight phaser ones. So you destroyed Bennett? I destroyed mm -hmm. Bennett. Bennett is destroyed. And that shuttle is just sitting there still? No, oh, his no off. shuttles are gone too. Shuttles are destroyed. I just I just blew up Bennett, Luis. I right. just destroyed him. One. I'm just trying to make sure I don't move out of any arcs, but I think I'll have enough weapons to fire either way. Um. Okay. Because I forgot. <laughs> Never mind. I'll do it on. I'll do it next impulse because I I haven't uh, I haven't announced it yet. So. All right. So I'm gonna remove your shuttles. I'm gonna remove your ship. Um. Yeah. The chance of of rolling all sixes there was six in ten million. No. So. I, no. I know. I know. That's <laughs> it, it. Was it was more being funny or trying to be funny, but well, you realize the, the desperation no, there. That's, that's I, for sure. That's for sure. I, I had to destroy you because if you hit me before they do, then all right, olives. Yeah, give them hell. GG's Bennett. Thank you. <laughs> all right, we'll move on to impulse seven. Um, 19s and up. I guess nineteens are nineteens are gone. So never mind. But twenty fours and up. All right. Uh, I think I can slip. Yes. Oh, what's that do? Range six. This is gonna hurt. Go ahead. 
that. Impulse eight. Um, 24s and up. I guess that, I guess that might matter where I put these guys, doesn't it? As long as they keep going forward. Yeah. <laughs> Not like this. Not like this. And you have you have you have plenty of stuff left to fire, right? Well, I have fired eight phaser ones, one phaser three, and all and four, four of my disruptors. Yeah. Oh, okay. So you're. So I'm I'm about done. <laughs> but you're pretty tanky. But I'm pretty tanky. I'm I'm pretty big. You're gonna hurt me, but mm -hmm. I'm gonna survive it. Just don't know how greedy I should get. I imagine I'm pretty greedy. Come to range zero. Yeah, because we, we, have, get we cookie. have cookies. Because all of your zero, all your shields are just at zero, and I know this, right? Correct. Okay, I just want to make sure I didn't pop into like hex three, and then all of a sudden you say, "Well, hey, dumbass, I just activated a four hexer." <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess go ahead. All right. Impulse uh, nine, thirty twos only. That's six strikes from the scatter pack. Yep. That's twenty four more off of my ESGs. Okay. So, so I'm. How close, are, how close are we to accessing your ship with the drones? Um. Right. Well. Um. Let's see. All four of my ESGs are still up. Mm-hmm. But you've done 36 total points of damage, and you would know based on um, based on the how, the, many the, of... how many things have hit it, and how many ESGs yeah. I've got, and the radius okay. that I've gotcha. I've got 80 total that points. Have, I was gonna say, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, because you have how many shields? And how many ESGs? Four ESGs at at range zero, and they're 20 apiece. Gotcha. Yep. Oh, I was thinking there was zero to five. Uh, oh, I see. Yeah. I got gotcha. you. The shield is five. The shield starts at 20. It's like zero 20, and then it shrinks in every time you go further out. Or... Yeah, so... Okay. Yeah. At range zero... zero range 20 shield. Correct. And at, at, further, yep. further you go out, it's... Yeah. All right. Impulse 10. 24 and up. Okay, what's my... I turned on turn five. Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. So this Move. is the fifth turn, and I'm at 24. Yeah. So I think I don't think I can now. I think I have to wait for the next one. Your, your turn mode... Is one to five. Or is five. Is five, yeah. So you got to move five times between turns. You're correct. Yep, 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 yep. I had a T written down by the next impulse. So I think I was correct about that. Yep, you're correct. Okay, so unfortunately I have to... Oh, I could slip again. Um, I just want to make sure I'm not... I'm trying to think about my phaser. What bears and what doesn't bear. I'm going to go ahead... Because I continue to forget to announce it, I'm going to go ahead and raise my uh, my rear shield. shield. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, boy. This is... Uh, this is getting serious. <laughs> I think I just have to be patient here. Impulse 11. Um, everybody moves. Okay. You coming at me um, here? You're slip I, I am... Um, yeah, I'm going to have to slip towards you. Because I can't, I can't turn yet. Wasn't your last move a slip? Um, my last move was... Um, the HET, and that would be a slip. Uh, so, um, HET does not reset turn modes or doesn't reset slip modes. So, you would be correct. I have to, I have to move forward. I don't have a choice. But now I have. I'm, I'm good. Oh, you! I see you. High energy turn going the opposite direction. Correct. I got gotcha. you. <clears throat> I see you now. Well, um. Well, then I think I just... Well, that guy's going to go there. Yep. 
I haven't moved yet, so I think... Okay, this guy goes here. And I go there. Uh... <laughs> here we go! <laughs> I mean, I think it's I think it's showtime. I don't know. I mean, I... I guess you're not going to move again for a while, though, so... That's true. Um... I might as well get greedy and try to get... I think I gotta yeah. get greedy here. You gotta right? try. You gotta try. I mean, I, I, there's only one more I can go before I run into shield, so I might as well try to get to one. Yeah. Okay, let's let's keep going. This is this is turn what? That was, impulse it, that was it. That was eleven. That was eleven. Okay. Yeah. Impulse twelve. Um, twenty-four and up. All right. So this drone. That one. That one hits. I'm at forty. That collapses two of my ESGs, so I'm down to I'm down to two. This one, which two? The the new two. Okay. And they are full strength, currently. Uh, well, here's the problem. I have to fire now because I think on the next move. I'm going to run into his shields because I can't slip. Um, <laughs> <laughs> just realized that. <laughs> so, because <laughs> that bastard ain't moving, that's for sure. Um, but then uh, I, I got I I to I just go then. Right? I just, I can't, I got to go. I'm just going to fire everything I have that it bears at you. And yeah. I'm going to drop my batteries. You have a turn. Always. You can turn. Oh, I see. I have a turn, and yeah. so we're just like we're just like riding next to each other on the, on the basically. On the at yeah, I do have a turn. Yeah, you're, but I you're think drifting gonna... into me. Yeah. All right, so I'm I'm going to fire. Okay. Um, I don't have a lot, but I am going to fire. Okay. And you're dropping batteries for what? I was going to overload some disruptors. I have three oh, batteries, sweet. so what? So do you I, can, I can you can overload one. Two. I can overload one because it takes two. Yeah. So I discharge two batteries and overload a disruptor. Okay. All right. So I'm firing four disruptors and I guess my front two phasers and I guess my phaser 360. I have two phaser 360s. No, I have a phaser one and a 360. Um, You've got every weapon on your ship currently bears on me. So yeah, you've got systems go. Yeah. Oh, because got... I'm directly right there. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I gotcha. I'm well, sorry. Line. <laughs> Well, then we're just going to do it. Yeah, do it all. Uh, he can't my, fire uh, his ADDs at your ship, can he? He cannot, sadly. Uh. <laughs> I mean, he can. They just don't do any damage. Okay. You can uh, stand, stand in the windows and fire hand phasers at my ship. I don't care, but they're not going to do any damage. Yeah, yeah, do that too. Do that too. <laughs> yeah, disruptors first. first. Yeah, so you've what's got... This, what's this narrow salvo stuff? One roll ru to rule that. them all. Don't do not do that. <laughs> or in my case, one roll to ruin them all. The problem yeah, is I have, an, I, I have an overload. That's how you lose. Oh, yeah, I see. That's how you lose? Yes, that's how you lose. He has too much HP, though. I'm not going to beat him. Well, you should at least see how much damage you can get. You're in. right. You're right. Yeah. You're right. You're right. Uh, Got it. This first roll's a, four, a one to four, though. You're a, you're a one to five, no matter what I'm you're one doing. To five. Yeah. God, so, shouldn't I, so shouldn't I do it? No. <laughs> What, what's because the worst it, can happen? I roll a six? Yeah, you roll a yeah. six and you deal <laughs> zero damage. I have an 84% chance of... No, don't of, do a narrow oh, stop. Oh, I see, yeah. I see, because now I'm... The chance that I'm going to... Okay, I see what you're saying. Ponies has lost the game because he did that. All right, hit. 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 Miss. Hit. 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 So we'll say that the hit. first one was the overload? Yeah, that was my overload, yeah, yeah. Okay. So that is total. That is 20 points of... Of damage mm -hmm. from the disruptors, great. Yeah, and that is on my number five shield. Yeah. Okay. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. If I would have a narrow salvo, Bennett, I would have got. I would have got five more. Twenty-five. Yeah. Yeah, you would have. All right. <laughs> so I now you got my call. <laughs> you got your, your six uh, phaser ones. I assume that those are firing as well. Oh yeah. Is that what is that a D? What is that D six? Yeah, all D six. Okay, all D sixes. And we'll count them as they go. That's well, they're they're rolling against the table, so you're each one. Oh, I see. And I'm yeah. range one, so oh, yeah. sweet. 
So five. Yeah, five total. Oh, that's thirteen total. Eighteen total. 18. Oh boy, you're rolling really well. Twenty-five. Five. Uh, Twenty-nine. One more. Yep. And thirty-four. Thirty-four. All right. So eight of that goes on the shield, which means you get uh, twenty-six in. Twenty-six in turn. I'm going to fire the left side phaser threes before I lose them. Um, and I'm firing them right back into your face. Okay. Um, Question, so, ponies. Yeah. Is there a way he can hit, like, I? this is my forgetfulness again. So, you know, if I take damage when I have my fighters in, I take extra damage. Mm -hmm. Does that work? Like, if is there anything for your big ships? Um, you, here? you know what? I honestly do not know. So I will, um, who knows Olives? Maybe you'll roll like all 12s and knock out all his bridges and we'll win. <laughs> <laughs> Loses awesome. control. That would be, that would be something. <laughs> so if they are being, let's see. Who do I tell? Who, uh, who, which hydrants do I need to inform that we won if we do win? Oh, heads up. Um, Damage points did. scored on a ship with PFs docked aboard may be applied to the ship or to okay. any one of the PFs at the owning player's option. Okay. Um, at the, who's what player's at the, option? At the owning player. Okay. My option. Hmm. Owning player cannot allocate to a PF, a damage point designated for a type of systems that the PF does not have. Okay, that makes sense. So I can put I can put the damage yeah. that comes in when you roll them. I can put them on either my PFs sure. or my ship. And that that makes sense since you haven't deployed them. So correct. Yep. So I've got yeah. eight more hull. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. So they're even tankier. So if if he hits a bridge, for example, you can just kill the bridge on one of your PFs. I I I, I could I think. Um, which would leave the PF an ox oh, it says list, but... the player only player cannot allocate to a PF a damage point designated for another type of system that PF doesn't have okay PF, um, yeah um, an ox con hit could not be allocated to a PF which doesn't have that system if a PFT has an undestroyed ox con alright so yeah I can put hull hits and phaser hits and things like that on my PFs instead of my big ship but yeah so that's the... and then if for the um if if you take a, a warp on your pfs does it still do the it does okay yeah good to know all right um one additional rules clarification that i need to make here um, but I can take care of that after we're done with the 26 internals. So you have 34 internals. I I had eight points left you on my shield. Eight on the shield, yeah. Oh, son of a bitch. Yeah. That makes sense. Oh, That's why. Can I, I take field hits on my PS? Um, let's see. Do you have a uh, thorn mail or? <laughs> I don't have thorn mail, but it's about to get real thorny for you here in just a second. Um, uh, yeah, okay, good. Um, destroyed. HET would have been nice at this point, wouldn't it have been? For you? Well, of course, he's going the wrong direction, really. Uh, I mean, yeah, you're on his ass. Yeah. Um... Mines, Sorry. I guess you can drop mines out on me. He doesn't. Well, the problem with that is I don't. I don't. I don't oh, I I've used two mines already. So he's used yeah. two. one. One mine. And already. obviously, once this all this damage is resolved, we're probably just gonna. We're talk probably about... gonna we're probably yeah, gonna call yeah. it. Yeah. I mean, realistically, you just fly off into the sunset and leave because he can't chase and you. Go tell your wife the bad news. Yeah. Something like that. Do hydrants talk to Kazentis? Will they even let me mm -hmm. in the base? Yeah, yeah, no, we're allies, I think. Okay. In a in a space in a spacesuit, hydrants breathe methane, so mm -hmm. 
Gotcha. So I go back and say, hey, I'm sorry. Uh, I know last week it didn't go well, and but <laughs> I have bad news again. <laughs> uh, this week it really maybe, didn't go can, well. Can you send somebody else with me for next week? I think we can do it this time. <laughs> for next <laughs> week. Uh, who, oh, do you have any more hydrants you can throw uh, <laughs> at the cause? Because he keeps dying in, in my defense. Uh, Live okay. in fame or die in flame. Yeah, it's so easy to second guess, but obviously I could have started a little closer. I think I should have went faster the first turn. I should have gotten myself. I think I to... should have realized I had eight EP well... on the first turn. <laughs> That's what I think. I should have been paying more attention to my it SSD. It would have definitely allowed you to move faster because you probably it would have put have. speed. But him going 28 speed was something we didn't expect. Okay. PFs cannot PFs. operate their shields while docked. So okay. that that okay. doesn't that doesn't help me at all. Oh, so no shields for them. Yeah, they don't have shields. Okay, so. there you go. Well, all that right, makes so sense. Yeah. Let's just roll them. Okay. Oh, okay. All, Wait, no, all did you of fire, you roll. What did you fire? I fire. I haven't fired my two phaser threes. You're right. I need yeah, to fire both of those. So, uh, oh boy, bang bang, uh, eight points of damage back to you for a phaser three. Uh, at range, at range uh, oh. one. Yes, uh, confirming. Yeah, right. Oh, oh, you rolled two. I was yeah, like, wow, since when does a phaser yeah, yeah. three single <laughs> kill eight damage? <laughs> yeah. yeah. So eight Where points to your front shield. Yep. And I had okay eight uh, on the front. Yeah. So I'm. Oh, I got plenty there. I'm assigning that now, yeah. Uh, trying to, anyway. Gotta go to RGB. There we go. Alright. I really Dang. need to stop Dang. playing everything like it's a Gorn ship. <laughs> 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 I just charge in like it can take it all, but... I guess um, I can't. Maybe, maybe next time we'll play... You guys can play the same ships, and I'll play a Lyran ship and a Klingon ship that are equivalent in size, so that you guys aren't having to individually take the brunt of a battle cruiser. Because that's, I think, that is really the only thing that you guys are are struggling with at this point in time is, yeah, that you have to take the Alpha Strike of a battle cruiser on a destroyer or on a on a command cruiser, and that's not that's yeah. not an easy thing to do. Um, yeah. Alright. So now we can roll the 26. All of you roll them. Bennett, you okay. count them. Okay. Eight. Eight. Eight is an aft hull. Seven. Is a forward hull. Oh, so, wait, I, I can take that back. That's, a, that's actually a cargo hit, which is my repair boxes. Okay. Okay. Nine. Is a left warp engine. I'm going to take on the ship. I'm not stupid. <laughs> Ten is a phaser three. Ten is a tractor, which is going to be uh, one of the tractors that I do not have attached to my uh, PF. Does your so what happens if you lose a tractor with a PF on it? It will detach the PF. Um, okay. Yeah, and that's not something that I want to happen. <laughs> oh, so if that happens, you'll fly off. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, okay. We're yes. looking for those tractor hits. <laughs> All right, did you get that nine I just rolled? Um, was that the second? That was the second nine? Yeah, so that'd be a forward oh, yeah. hull. Okay. Got it. Five. It's a right warp engine. Two. Oh, hit me where I live. That's the bridge. Oh, cool. Bang. So and you don't you obviously you don't want to take it on the fighter because that would cripple the fighter. Correct. Could they, could they do anything without a bridge? Nope. Uh, no, okay. not at all. Okay. They only have one bridge. You sure you don't want to hit? I'm sure. <laughs> Thanks though. <laughs> Eleven. Oh, Big that's a torpedo. Off. That's a Big torpedo. Uh, we're gonna pop a ten. There's a left warp engine. Seven. Is a okay. repair box. Six. Six is a forward hull. Nine. Is a forward hull. Four. Is a phaser. Phaser three. Nine. Is a forward hull. Four. Oh man. 
is a transporter. Oh, a transporter. No, that's a, that's I, you hit that you phaser already, that, right? I hit that phaser. Yeah. Yeah. That, I, yeah. I do have do transporters. Have a transporter still? Okay. I, I should. Where is it? Yeah, I knew okay. you got rid of them a while ago, but that was. Um... Yeah. There you go. Tractor is what you hit before. No, I mean I thought you let it go transporter bomb off while ago, and I was thinking maybe you didn't have it anymore. Oh, I see. Yeah. Uh, six. Forward hull. Six. Forward hull. Last time in that category. Oh, I got center hull. Sweet. Cool. Three. Oh, shit. That is an ESG. Oh, because your drones count as ESG? Yes. I need to refresh the stream. It's way delayed on my end. I keep thinking you're forgetting to do stuff. And... Uh... Well, I have no idea what I'm doing. There we go. Refresh. Okay, I'm hitting it again. Yep. Six. Is a forward hull. Six more to go. Okay. After that six. Yep. Okay. Nine. The forward hull. Five we to go. 26 internal, yeah. Correct. So five. Five left. Ten. Is a left warp engine. Four to go. Eleven. Is a phaser. That one's got to be one that... Um, that bears and has to be one of the, the harder ones or the, the, the worst ones. Alright, that's a phaser one. Three to go. Four. Uh, it's a right warp engine. Two to go. Ten is a left warp engine. Last one. Nine. Uh, Another forward hull. Alright. So, before we end... <laughs> Olives, you still have one battery left, right? I do. I have an idea. <laughs> <laughs> so one point charges five transporters, right? That's correct. Oh, interesting. Okay. Olives, you should drop your front shield and lay all four of your bombs on top oh. of the ship. Yeah, that's a good point. Well, because I so, don't think he has anything else. So he has he has ESG still though. I do. Yeah, but you can turn. You have a turn ready. Yeah. Your last turn's over here, so right now you well, so, lay all the mines. So that would that would be great in theory, unless mm -hmm. he moves next impulse. Because transporter actions happen before weapons fire. So okay. he'd have to wait and do that the next impulse. Yeah. Now he could do that. Um, moving speed 24. No, he does not move next impulse. Okay. And you would know that. Okay. So well, olives. <laughs> so be before you make well, that decision, I don't really want to do it because the hydron, my hydron co-captain is dead, and I didn't know the rules. So no, it's, it's perfectly well. It's, your, it's perfectly your fine. Would know the rules. Yeah, oh, that's true. Right. You Bennett is now your first officer who is right. <laughs> who is <laughs> providing you support. But yeah, so yeah. so so you would know uh, placing a placing mines on a on a hex. Yeah, um, with ESG. With ESG, it, that would that would absolutely work. But the best that you're gonna do with your what you've got? How many transporters? He has I got three. One, one box, four bombs. Right, but you can only place one bomb per per box. Um, okay, so one. But you, but he's, oh, well, he's got three. Got, There's I two in the four. back. He's got three. He's got three. Where's well, I have four where... boxes on my left side of my C my SSD, but. You're Where's right, your I only see three. Yeah, three transporters. So you could you could activate all three transporters. You could place three bombs. That's that's something you could absolutely do. And then the next time that I move, I I would hit those and they would go off against my ESGs. That's 100% oh, correct. The ESGs, fuck. Yes, yeah, I still have the ESGs. He's still got a lot of points left. He's got like Never 30 mind. points left in Yeah, those. that wasn't If not for the ESGs. So mine rules come into effect. We've we've glossed over this because we've never had a situation where we've had a ship that is moving slow enough that they may not set off a mine. That's true. <laughs> whenever whenever you are whenever you encounter a mine's explosion radius or or it's it's trigger radius, you roll a d6 and if the d6 is under your speed, the mine goes off. Okay. It, oh. I have a fifty percent chance of not setting off mines because I'm moving uh -huh. slow enough. I gotcha. 
Yeah, it was an idea. Yeah. It's an idea. <laughs> um... How much do mines do? Ten. Okay, so it wouldn't... If you didn't have the ESG, that yeah. would if I didn't have potentially the ESGs kill him. But you're out of weapons now, right? He is out of weapons. So for the rest of this turn, the fact that I'm going to be able to turn right here and avoid your ESG, I can pretty much just fly away. You can't do anything about it. Yeah, you fly. I'm just seeing if there's anything else we can or you can do. Yeah. To maximize. And I, and this I didn't damage. really hurt him too bad. I mean, how much power did we take? We didn't take any power away, did we? No, no we, took, you got, we took six away. You got six. Six power. Six. You got three weapons. Uh, three phasers, a, and disruptor, a disruptor, and an ESG. Yeah. How many tractors do you have? Four. I'm yeah, three four. left. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So, so here's the thing. Um. I, I the the rule that I needed to look up was how quickly after launching my PFs can they fire? Oh, I see. Because that the, that's the offense he still has. That's the offense uh -huh. that I, I retain. And I would have to rely on my speed. Um, right. And your ESG doesn't affect them when you launch them? No. Oh, so you, until oh, they move through it. If they leave. Gotcha. Yeah. So you'd, have to, you'd have to just release them and have them fire immediately. Yeah. And then you'd run off with whatever you took. What yeah. speed do they get released at? Zero. So they get oh, released they at speed zero, but they can make a mid-turn speed change up to whatever they decided oh, so to, you can, to change you can, it to. They ha basically, that protects you, so they can hover there until you tell them to move. To move Correct. So they, they'd get their one hit off, and then you'd gotcha. fly off with yeah. whatever. So and that's the thing. once you declare a fighter's speed, then that's their speed forever. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, well, so they are mini ships, so, so the they can change turn. speeds. Yeah, so the next turn. Okay. Yeah, um, okay, I see now. So I can't, I can't find the rule that says how quickly they can fire after launch. If that's the case, if it's not, if it's the case that they can fire immediately, then they will. They're going to fire four overloaded disruptors and a bunch of phasers into whatever shield you present to me, uh -huh. and then that's going to be that's basically going to be it for me for the turn. Gotcha. Um. But either way, yeah. If your plan is to run for the border and get away, then. That's what happens because I can't stop you. Even even yeah. if I do enough damage to hurt you, I'm not going to destroy you. I'm not going to cripple you. You're going to be able yeah. to get away. Uh -huh. So, question about the mines then. If he put mm -hmm. his three mines on top <clears throat> of your ship, uh huh, and then um, and then you deployed your your little guys, mm -hmm. would they get hit by the mines too, or would it just be the ESG? only only if they? No, so, if I hit them with the ESG. I believe that the damage goes directly to the ESG, and if so, directly to the ship. But I can confirm that. I just, I just don't know the. Either way, it's not going to change the olives gets away. Yeah. Correct. Unless you get the, the absolute. Well, no, I don't even think that will do enough damage to kill him. I can no, I, I can do forty points of damage with disruptors if I hit with all set all all four. I'll do a, a nominal amount with my phaser twos and phaser threes. It's not going to yeah, be he'll enough. Be out. He'll be he'll, out. He'll still he'll be hurt, but he'll be he'll get out. I can't stop that from happening. Mm -hmm. And worst case scenario, if you do drop the mines on me, I declare emergency deceleration. I or I turn off my ESGs. Because what's the repercussions if I only have one battery left? I don't have the battery. I don't have the battery for how many turns? Never. No, you, no, you, you just, you, just you until you recharge it. it. Whenever. Yeah. Oh, okay. You put power into it in energy allocation, and that power's back. It just, oh, but yeah. it drops my front shield. It does drop your front shield, and yeah, that's the yeah, one thing you do that, yeah. don't want to yeah. do right now. That's true. And I, well, put two shield, I put two shield one reinforcement on this this round, too. Yeah. Oh, well, you should have said that when you took damage on your front shield. Well, I think, figured it didn't matter. I was going to mention it at some point before you oh, okay. got rid of it that's all. Fair. Yeah. yeah. But either he way. Already the, he already made the thing. So, yeah. so, yeah. My, so my, 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 play, my new plan was to, was to turn... Mm -hmm get away from you and eventually get back to my shuttle. Right. Which I don't think I would do on this turn. I would get about halfway there, then spend next turn collecting both my shuttles. My question is, sometime in turn three, theoretically, I'm basically far enough away from you where you can't really fire me yet. Mm -hmm. And I think I get to my shuttles, let's say it's turn three, impulse 20 or something, and I just picked up both my shuttles. Right. What can I do with those sh empty shuttles? Can can I put drones on them the minute they get back in my ship? You can start loading them. Yeah, um, 
but it takes a full turn for a deck crew action to happen, and a deck mm-hmm. crew action is adding a, a number yeah. of drones. Yeah. So I think I'd have to go about 32 speed. <laughs> <laughs> I'd have to go full speed next turn um, to get to my shuttles, start charging them. Yeah. So And then by the time I get to in, turn four, maybe slow myself down in turn four, and so I don't have to... Yeah. argue keep flying away from you or keep fast but keep flying away from you until i'm i'm ready to actually fire stuff out again well if you did a high energy turn and turned completely around you could get to one shuttle in 17 well i mean i can't do the high energy turn until the next turn now so yeah that's true yeah yeah so i'd have to do it all on, on just whatever impulse movements i have here anyway i think that's my strategy was just to see if i could last a turn five or something and yeah. but the bad part bad part is i'll have a teammate anymore like you said the minute the battle the minute you get to me it's over yeah well, so at this point in time, with the damage that I've taken, um, I'm, I'm reduced by six points of power, and uh-huh. but I've also you've also helped me out that there's what nine, ten, eleven points of power that I no longer need for the next turn. Oh, because the ESG is gone. Because the ESG is gone, my one of my disruptors is gone, three yeah. of my phasers is gone. So, so how I'm many still. Could you throw at me going forward? Well, my ESGs have been reduced down to I've only got, I've only got three. So that would be what, sixty, potentially sixty if I can and run zero, over you. But you might, but you might extend them out. In right that situation, yeah, yeah. I think you're in pretty good shape. You I'm, might I'm last still in a while, but yeah, I'm still in good shape. I still got yeah. both my my Bobcats, so I've I've got options. Yeah, it would take some pretty nifty driving by me to just stay away from you, but have my drones target you, mm-hmm. and you know it would. Maybe several turns down the road, I've still been able to at least get all my sixty drones out and peck at you. Yeah. <laughs> Until, uh, but your fighters is what would probably cause me the trouble. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, but a much better, much better um, total um, outcome for the alliance this time. You managed to get inside my shield. It only costs you a destroyer um, and two fighters only. <laughs> um, I took a I took about the same amount of damage as I did last time, except this uh-huh. time I took it on the ships instead of on the Bobcats. Uh-huh. Um, you, you took never less... released your fighters. Yeah, you took less damage because this zero, time, yeah, Olives. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. and so well, of course, of course, I started farther away from you, and you immediately decided to go after Bennett. Yeah, that's true. So I just was I took less damage because I wasn't even on your radar. Well, okay. you you took yourself you took yourself off my radar by bumping that's right. your that's true. ECM that's true. because I wanted to get my I wanted to get my drones. Oh, I see. So when you heard my ECM, you said I'm not going after him. Where do uh, I see uh, how I much? Gotcha. Where do I yep. see how much damage my explosion would do? Um, it would be on the ship data table. I'll I'll share that with you right now. Yeah, um, you were going to kamikaze into his. Yeah, I'm I'm wondering how much <laughs> that actually would have changed. So I will uh, see. That's going to be in the master annexes or the master ship charts. Yeah, let me, um, let me pull that up. Yeah, I'm opening it as well. Oh, so, um, uh, master ship charts. Yeah, for the warrior. Mm, I know what I'm naming my. If we're doing these same ships, I know what it's being named next week. HMS Garen. <laughs> Good old Demacia man coming in hot. Oh man, Demacia! So I can't be somebody from Demacia, but it has to be somebody that's not anti-Demacian. Maybe I'm the. Uh... Or you... no, maybe it's Trundle. Maybe I go Trundle. Trundle would be good too. With uh, with all the missiles that you've got, Olives, maybe you're Heimerdinger. Corky. Yeah, uh, Heimerdinger. Or, or Corky. Yeah. Either one. Yeah. yeah. Um, um, the warrior. I'm not seeing it on the list here. Kind of. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you're kind of. 1481 Bennett, and your explosion uh-huh. strength is 13. 13 damage. Yep. Um, we don't have to play the same ones next time if you don't want to, guys. I'm definitely getting more comfortable with the ship, though. I I'd be happy to continue playing. Like you guys continue playing those ships, and me try something different. To see if yeah, it yeah, makes yeah. if it makes a difference two ships versus one ship. Yeah. So yeah, that would be nice for me too to not play against the ESG and see what the drones can do. You know. Well, I think what well, you said you said one Klingon and one 
Yeah, a, a Lear so, and Anna so what Klingon. Are those, what are those ships? Yeah. Do what, are the, what? What should I know about those ships when it comes to the Klingons? Are, are like they don't have the SGs. They don't have. They're like. I mean, you saw us play Klingon versus Federation in the beginning, right? Yeah, the Klingon they stays have, away, right? No, the Klingon they drones. Away. They're Klingon like you, you, but yeah, you're you. Oh, okay. Except yeah. for you're more focused on drones, and they're more focused on maybe disruptors um, and and using drones to support. Yeah. Okay. But but. Um, all told, any any uh, appropriately sized ship or equivalently sized ship that I would have as a Klingon would have basically your same armament uh, minus drone racks. I'd have fewer drone racks and you would have uh, otherwise the same amount of uh, firepower. I'd have a few more yeah, phasers. Klingon could also, you'd be able to to try your hand, well, it's not really anything new, but it would be, it, you could, you, you'd be using ADD and such. Yeah, yeah dr something. drones and anti-drones. So gotcha, we could, yeah. we could absolutely do that. We could, I could play either two Lyrans or two Klingons or a Lyran and a Klingon and yeah. we just see where it falls. Yeah, I would like to see, I, I would kind of like to see Bennett be able to put these fighters into action or whatever. Well, I oh, think sure. no, they're they're gonna get blasted no matter what. I guess that's true. I think ponies respects fighters too much to let them. I respect I respect stingers too much, one hundred percent. Yes. Well, if you but, start it closer to one of the other ships, I guess they're both just as dangerous. The but. the problem is, is that my fighters can't fire until eight impulses after they're deployed, right? So that gives them eight impulses to hit them, and my uh, stingers are close range fighters, so it's not like I could do some sort of standoff. From far away they right. need to get up there so the best case scenario for those is i try and do like i deploy them and then i try and give them a two-pronged threat but the problem with doing that against this big ship is i get one shot yeah. so you know it's like, yeah so we are we, something. if you had if you had two ships ponies it's basically me versus you and bennett versus you but two different battles right well, i would say it'd still be the same battle you guys could oh cool Plan target, your... my drones could my drones could target the ship. Yeah, we could okay. we could do something like um, add terrain or something. That that's That'd something cool. we could do as well. Yeah. Why don't we? Um, so why don't we? We'll table that part. Let's yeah, yeah. in the in the intervening time. Let's figure out what ships we're going to be going at. Are okay. going at each other okay. with? You guys can keep the same ships if you like. Um, but let me know with enough time to where I can figure out what I'm going to okay. do as I mean, far as. If I stay with Kazinti's, I don't really want to go anything bigger than this. I don't think. No, we once we go bigger. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm okay. I just kind of I want to run this one back yeah. one more time. Yeah. I've been kind of just looking around, seeing seeing what's. And once yeah, if it's... you go bigger than this, it yeah. very quickly turns into fleet battles. Yeah, it's going to help make, me learn it even better with, rep with repetition. Yeah. Oh. Speaking of next time, mm -hmm. I have a, a, a now again. I'll I'll ha I'll let you know by like Thursday, but it's it's a maybe on my dad joining us. Oh, sweet! That would be so. Would be I fantastic. guess it, it kind of depends. Well, if he does, on, then you guys can fight me. And we can keep. Or... Yeah, we could, But I think uh, it's he's really busy with work right now so he said that he's gonna make it if he can but i would just plan on doing this three man for now but but just in case sure um just keep that in the back of the mind but i'll have that to you by thursday okay yeah you let me know um and i i, I want to get this out before i forget again but um on the idea of terrain mm -hmm. uh we will Day of, <clears throat> will randomly generate terrain. Great, cool. That way, nobody has really time to prepare for it because we really wouldn't be able to. Um, there is a local conditions chart that you can that okay. you, you can roll on, and uh, that's in um, uh, S five is local conditions. Okay. Um, we will treat uh, a wandering monster as empty space but okay. otherwise we will play uh, at uh, wandering monster and pirate as um as empty space but otherwise um the uh 
old minefield will be an asteroid belt, a gas giant or a variable pulsar, variable pulsar or a black hole or a nebula or a planet and moon. Those will all be as is. We'll just play them. I'll be prepared for any of them, and we'll just randomly generate those as they oh, as they come up. So, so if I was targeting one of your ships, you could get behind a black hole, right? Potentially, yeah. Black holes, okay. black holes do well. All of these things are going to do some crazy, crazy shit for us. Yeah, cool. See how it goes. Yeah. Neat. Um, all right. All right. Well, then, GG's I feel guys. A lot better about how I played tonight than how I played the other night. It it was a much better outcome for you guys. I feel like. Um, I think you 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 both played very very well. It. Um, I think the issue that you had if there is to be said that you had an issue this time around was exactly what we already discussed that um, Bennett you just get one shot whenever it, whenever it was decided that I was coming for you mm-hmm. and that was that was conditions based it wasn't it wasn't I hadn't decided early in the game that I'm coming out mm-hmm. coming after Bennett but when when it was decided that Bennett was gonna be my first target there's basically zero chance that Bennett survives that. The best he can do is try to do damage before I, I get to him and destroy him. And well, I yeah. just I just fired before you did. It would have been nice to, you know, <clears throat> me pay attention to my stuff. <laughs> I'm going to be punching myself over not noticing a whole four power for a long time. Well, hey, next week you'll notice it. And... Yeah. We'll yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm looking at the hydrogen ships right now, cool. and I'm kind of I'm I'm probably just gonna stick with what, I'm gonna stick with what I have. I don't see anything because I want to keep the fight. I could go with something without fighters. But I want to keep them for now. Yeah. Um. All right. Wait, oh, all right. So we'll we'll call it there. Um. No word on whether we're gonna have Bloodstone tonight or tomorrow night or not. I guess it's almost tonight. Um. <laughs> But expectation is um, this Thursday we'll be back for Air Apocalypse. This Friday will be the sponsored stream, the big time stream. So um, we're and then Saturday I, it, is, it is possible that I will be off again. I'm hoping that I can get back for some summoners, but um, it's still show week, so we'll we'll see how that goes. But uh, right. looking forward to seeing you guys. Hopefully tomorrow afternoon or tomorrow evening for some bloodstone if not that then definitely on thursday for some air apocalypse action and i'm i'm hoping tomorrow that i get the remainder of the information that i need from the big time guys and can make the official announcement with all of the the bells and whistles and the frills and um be looking forward to that i think it's going to be a lot of fun just um, throwing it out there about um, D and D tomorrow. If it is canceled due to Wi Fi, I'm going to be making some phone calls to internet providers because <laughs> I've been waiting for this cliffhanger for multiple weeks. Yes, <laughs> and... yes, I understand. I apologize for that. I'm <laughs> that hoping not your fault. Hoping that's not that's not an issue. I haven't talked. I haven't had a chance to talk to Alan Air yet to determine if that's been fixed. But I, I would imagine after three weeks it should be. So yeah. stupid ISPs. Yeah, no kidding. All right, guys, All right. have a great night. Thank you for the for the game. It was a lot of fun. GGS, and have a great night. GGS. GGS. Hey, olives. If yeah. um, if you want to change up your shift a little bit or a lot, just let me know. If you don't want to like go through and looking for yourself, feel free to do uh, that. But I can also find you some possibilities. 